clear. Not, not right, there, yeah. not there. It's a nice day, you know? It kinda, kinda. It's not too sunny. Hi. Hi people. Hello. Hey, how are you? It's construction going on. It's a little There's some yeah. construction. They can't hear yeah, that. The economy growing. Don't worry it's about it. important to City's grow. City's booming. We have lobs on though, it should sound. Yeah. Should sound fine. Supposedly can't hear the wind. Uh, anyway, welcome to Off Topic. Uh, today brought to you by Stitch Fix, Casper, and RTX 2019. Oh, Please. damn, really? That's and cool. lung cancer, apparently. Well, no, you don't uh, breathe this in. I think it's throat oh, sorry. cancer. Yeah. Sorry. Like mouth. mouth. Yeah. Oral yeah. cancer. This would be more yeah. oral. Mouth yeah. Oral, count, uh, oral cancer sounds like someone that's bad at fellatio. Or that person was oral cancer. <laughs> I barely got off. <laughs> <laughs> no, but, like, so this whole bit with the cigar, right? I kind of, like... I brought it up last week. I was like, I got cigars. Can we smoke it on the podcast? Like, kind of just being an ass about it. Turned into a whole conversation. And Mike, and then when that became a thing, Michael was like, okay, I'll be outside. I'll smoke one with you. Eric, broadcast Eric, was like, I'll, sm I'll smoke one with you too. I was like, sweet, we got a party. There's going to be like half the people inside, half out here. Today rolls around. No Michael, no Eric. <laughs> are we and allowed to smoke at work? I guess well, people doing smoke. It right now. I guess we are. Not in the building, I don't smoke think. Smoke break. Yeah, right, right. <laughs> With a cigar. We're outside. But then they were like, I, you know, I said, hey, do we really want to do it this week then? If there's no one here? And they were like, it's set up. We're fucking doing it. I was like, all right, <laughs> deal. So as soon as you roll out some fake turf and you've sandbagged an outdoor camera, then you definitely <laughs> wait, yeah. wait, this is fake? Yeah. What you're looking at here, this is <laughs> like, hey, it looks so real. Okay, I mean, this I've is our flavor. Your tripod. <laughs> <laughs> Look, at he, he was thinking about trying to show it, but... Uh, They're not. Yeah, you just hours of labor involved in just this setup right here. Show it with the mirror. We're getting some very funny looks by people walking by. Yeah. Yeah, so I actually walked by. She gave me, like, the sup kind of head bob. Yeah. Oh, I thought she was giving it to me, so I... Which Oh, was it to you? I don't know. Jenkins. Oh, okay. I didn't even actually kill her because she was almost here smoking. Well, you, you thought it was two? <laughs> she sucked Yeah, yeah it's a big, a big three. And she got she a well look So like we all look like idiots. fools. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, well, I, went, I went around the two hundred office like, who smokes cigars? I need to smoke cigars. So, so Kent was like, hey. I'll smoke a cigar, yeah. yeah. Apparently Andy and Ashley were also on board. But, you know, then I was like. I and Sarah, it. you didn't, you completely ignored her saying. Yes, you did. But you were like very in on it. You were like, I could. Yeah. Done it before. That's not the same. I probably won't vomit immediately. Can you? <laughs> is there such thing as a weed cigar? Probably. Sure. Why not? Called a, a, I think it's called a fatty. That is the most confident <laughs> nod yeah. I've ever seen in my entire life. It's the blunt. <laughs> called a fatty. Fatty, right? Dude, I smoked one of those cigars one time. I think I mentioned this last time. One of the really, it was like sh that like short, showed. but like that. Like yeah, that far around. Oh. That I threw up. <laughs> I went through it way too fast. I was in a pool. <laughs> I was like, I really want to get through this so I can go back to being underwater. <laughs> and then you could have had like a smoke. Huh? That would have been such a mess, man. No, I got out. Do I you think you could jam a cigar in the top of a snorkel and get it done underwater? <laughs> that was in the Smoked Far Cry thing. Remember that? Was it? Yeah. But, um, you know the whole thing where I forget the name of the actor who does Voss. He was in Spider Man as Matt Gargan. That uh, guy. But that guy. He did a whole live action thing where he was like torturing a producer as Voss. And like he had him buried in the sand, like, you know, neck deep. Up to his neck. And yeah. so one time the tide came in, so it was just a tube coming out of the water. <laughs> and he was like talking about him and stuff like that and splashing him. And then he just shoved his cigar in the tube at one point. Oh, awesome. Like it sounds miserable. Like, what? It was, but you're uh, asking if I could smoke it. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, probably. That's just Maybe. what a cigarette holder is. Yeah. I feel like you'd have to like wrap fit, it a little bit to make yeah. it fit the tube. But. If it fit the tube perfectly, I think you could do it. Yeah. It's bloody oddly hot. It just right. got hot in the sun. It was it's yeah. like 30 degrees today. That means nothing to you. No. It's hot. Yeah. It's, oh, it, in, in it human temperatures, up. right. Yeah, no, it's like 60-something is yeah. what it's supposed to be. But it I don't feel like, like it's 60 It feels degree. like more like 70-something. Is it 80 today? It's like high 30s, like I, two I days. Oh, you're right. It's fucking cold. 85 degrees. Yeah, that's 60. I don't know, man. That's it, it went from <laughs> why wouldn't it cold be cold out for Texas? I get it. People, yeah. you know, it's I've fucking, been from the north too. I get it. It's 87 today. From the on north. Monday, it's going to be 58. Yeah. The uh, I, I weather, was, man. I met oh, a guy. Weather, man. <laughs> what do you do? I met a guy in Phoenix who he told me he broke his thermometer, which I didn't understand what he meant at first. I just thought he like dropped a thermometer and broke it. But uh, he he actually crashed a motorbike and smashed his head and lost the ability to tell. What temperature? What temperature? <laughs> and he lived in Phoenix. It's like the worst place ever. That seems like oh, the best great. thing ever. Yeah. Like he just never knows if he's too hot. He like he just passes out if he gets too hot. Just, just, oh, yeah, just feel oh, the negative effect. Like, yeah. Not sweat. Yeah, I mean, does I he not notice know. a flop sweat? 
Well, no. Like, holy I mean, shit, my, my shirt is suddenly sticking to me at every place. Well, yeah, I feel like but in guess, Arizona, that's every day. It yeah. is. Okay, but so also, I guess dry, if, if your body it's couldn't tell hot. anymore, then you wouldn't sweat. Well, no. It's, I mean, is he unable to perceive it? I, mean, I don't know. know. We gotta, we gotta get him. We gotta yeah. get him on the phone. How long hole. would he last in Antarctica? I call horse shit on your story. <laughs> not long. It's not horse shit. I got, I got a picture of the he guy. Goes, he goes to Ant- <laughs> he goes to Antarctica and he's like, humid, pleasant, <laughs> pleasant. <laughs> hey, hey, hey what's up, bro? What up? You guys have the only one smoking. Oh, Kent's smoking. Is that mics on? That's uh, oh. that's why we have Kent here. Are you doing the whole thing out here? No, we're okay. gonna move in a little bit. You mean you don't just like? Did you steal another Reese's smoke? cup? No, I had some birthday cake. Happy birthday, whoever. <laughs> Someone's birthday? <laughs> I'm gonna shit so hard. Dude, I can't eat sugar anymore. I had a bunch of Reese's peanut butter cups yesterday. I had taken, boy. it has ripped my asshole apart. <laughs> I don't even know if I can hear you right uh, now. Jeff said he ate. Where's the mic? Oh, it's not clip on? Yeah, they're blobs. Oh. Jeff shit himself to death, is what he said. Hi, audience. How are you guys doing? I ate sugar yesterday and I shit my brains out. You guys, my can body actually... can't process sugar anymore. Jeff's yelling at me. I just Jeff. ate some sugary cake. For they some could go on the set and probably have a birthday. conversation with them. You can and actually sit down on the minutes, set. We can I'm gonna hear you shit out my here. intestines yeah. out. You can sit on the set and we can hear you. Yeah, yeah. Talk to us from the set. Yeah. You too, Trevor. <laughs> we just we just try to have the most people on the podcast at once as possible. We this is a way to do it. We have yeah. like an annex set. Then we just have a third location to call in. <laughs> Let's see if we get those, those inside gaming guys now. We, we don't have to call them Funhouse anymore. That's can you ask who will hear us? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah we can. Yeah. Can you hear us? We can hear you. Hey, oh, guys. Yes. Hello. Yeah. I bet this sounds really good. How you doing? Good. So back, like to, that. back to my shits. Okay. Oh, yeah. no. no, it's fine. Hey, uh, you know, we've been playing a little Anthem. Have you played it at all, Jack or Jeff? Or no, to... I've got it downloaded. I haven't started playing it yet. Though. Watch Ryan play. Pretty fun so far. It looks really, really, really good. Like it. I thought the, the worst part about Anthem is Ryan's really bad at it. It's hard to watch. What are you talking about? I was doing great. <laughs> Did you do it last watch? <laughs> no. They just no, no, they no, no, actually no. watched me, but we didn't record it. Oh, why not? <laughs> I'm glad it wasn't recorded because it was embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> we have no visual evidence. No, unlike the uh, what happened to Matt's keyboard. <laughs> yes. I still want to figure out what happened. All right, yeah. Sarah, she's figuring it out. Did you pull up the footage yet? She's no, going to go go check, right check right now. Matt is going to check right now. Matt is then she'll very... slack me. Just how slack me the information. Very angry yeah, slack Ryan. Ryan. Hey, Matt, how long have you had that stupid rogue streak in your hair? I just noticed that now. <laughs> Are you like, kidding me? Months? Months? Oh He's worked with us for so long. Months I've had that. To need to know that you have a rogue streak in your hair. Matt's having a day, man. I, like dude. Trevor was was creating the uh, was creating the split for potential panels at RTX and uh, left <laughs> Matt off. I was talking to him about it too. I'm like, <laughs> standing right yeah, one him. of those would work. Hey, Anna Paquin, calm right down. Right here, <laughs> we'll get it fixed. <laughs> anyway, uh, nah, nah, nah. I came back from shooting some yesterday. Hey, Jimmy, don't let him touch you. He'll steal everything. He's gonna take your power. I came back from shooting some yesterday, <laughs> and you, uh, <laughs> you, assumably, poured a bunch of shit on my desk. Assumably? <laughs> now, now, let, let me ask you this. Assumably? I, I assume he did it. Why don't you steal hell, somebody's Matt? grammar powers? Right, Matt, assumably. what would make you assumable that it was me? You're you. Right? Yeah. Yeah. But there's other people in working in there, I spilt on myself there. There's other you people also... working in there, you think it was me who did it. This is you... a crazy angle for you. What do you mean? Like, going out to try to make it look like other people. <laughs> what? What? I mean, it could have been Sarah. Kiss. Kiss. He's just owning. <laughs> he what, what should I be owning, Jeremy? You seem to know a lot about it. You poured the water beads all over it. It was all over. So it's like it's some like... cheap knockoff Orbeez. Yeah. I put yeah. some in a cup of water, right? <laughs> Slow zoom. Wait, and you just said you like <laughs> I put <laughs> some in a cup of water, uh-huh. right there. Uh, I sort of teased Jeremy's <laughs> desk with it. I was like, ah, Jeremy, ah. Was great color number. Then I put it down, and that's where my story ends. That's where your story ends? <laughs> and that's what happened all over your desk. It's windy out here. My yes. story ends. Well, that's correct. That Orbeez were all, you put a cup of Orbeez on my desk, little drips, and then I went to do, where were we? We were in, we were doing something else. We came back from something. What were we doing yesterday? Uh, uh, what did we do yesterday? We were like in another room or yeah, something for some reason. Dude, I don't remember. I, I've I lost we, yesterday. Oh, we I wasn't there. We were doing a action so. thing for a video that's coming out. Right. So we were doing a live action shoot. Uh, came back in the room, Matt walked in like with me, or like I think he, a little bit after. It was a little I, bit after, yeah. A little bit after me. And then I heard him walk up to his desk and go, <sighs> and I walked over. <laughs> and there it was. Well, see, but that's the thing. He helped me clean it up. He should have. 
You, that's that's the thing. Now you put doubt in my mind that makes me think. Don't let him. Don't let him. Yeah, keep doubt. You don't, don't, you don't normally do help me clean up shit. I'm still waiting. That is one way to hide your. We have a camera in the office. We sent Sarah to go. Pelted. Check I know. The camera. It's true. And you were like, this will turn to water and hurt things. So it, well, like, and that's why I immediately I cleaned it up. Yeah. But that, then I you've already been planning some retribution. It yeah, seems. I have. Have you done it? Have you executed? No, I haven't. I haven't executed. No. Yeah, I wanted you to be here for it. Okay, that's for the best. So, yeah. You might want to hold off. I don't, there was, there I don't was think I do. Hey, Jeremy, oh, gonna get Jeremy back can you make it. Matt smoke a cigar? Or at least Matt. take a toke or two off he, a cigar. You want to watch Matt smoke hear a cigar? That? Do you want me? To do <laughs> you want him to cough? Yes, worse? we do. Please, yes. It might make your hair brunette again. Oh God. Jack, I've had this for seriously like a year now. <laughs> I guess you never look at me from that the, side. And Matt, the smoke will Matt? suffocate all no, the poisonous good. things you put in your body. I really miss that cloud that was out here. Yeah, I do too. Oh, oh God. We should probably go inside. Metal, we should go, go inside. Well, who yeah. put the tunnel? Should we send Matt Do you, you want to run away from the we're, sun? Look, go we're going to find mean? out. Sarah's checking the camera. Yeah, Sarah's looking at it. Let's let's go in. Let's go inside. Let's go. Make Matt smoke. Mm -hmm. Why don't you sit out here and you finish that? Make Matt smoke again. I offered it to him. He said no, and I don't believe in peer pressure. I die. Works. Kent, you look chill as fuck right I'm now. I'm just relaxing, you know? <laughs> just taking in this heat, basking in the sun. It's nice. Thank you, Kent. You're welcome, James. Thanks for Thank joining you. me for that. You're welcome. Cheers. Yeah. Cheers. You have fun out here. I'll try. I'm gonna melt. I'll see you later. Yeah. Yeah, you just keep keep win. that shot on Kent. I hope, right. I hope you're yep. really close right Kit now. Kit Cam. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is good. Oh. Get as tight as you can get. There you go. Yeah, whoa, whoa, it's there bad up there. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Hey, what, what, it's got crowded here all yeah, of a sudden. But it's air conditioned, so I like it. I just want to cool off for a bit. What? <laughs> That's nice. He's ah. perfectly hidden. <laughs> you it's can right see his ear. Yeah. Do we yeah. have too many? So Matt, I guess I only see you from this really? side. You're always to my left. Because I've true. never now seen I that streak before. Yeah, if you look on the camera, it's that is like the Doctor Hubbard excuse in The Simpsons when they found out that Homer had a fucking crayon in his brain for all these years, and he's like, "I guess I was always holding your X-rays with my thumb right here, perfectly <laughs> over the crayon." <laughs> we can move that way a little bit now because I think those there. two just okay. like. I just want to say, I want to sit closer. Right? <laughs> okay, you can get closer. It's all right. We can pack in. Yay. So much dark. I'm, I'm rarely on and off topic, in. so. It's, <laughs> <laughs> nope, and then Jeremy came back. Are you rarely on off topic? Is that true? Who noticed? Well, I'm rarely on. That looks like a turd and a like glass all tray right now. Ugh. Yeah. Oh, there we go. There it goes. Now it's chat. Dr. Hibbert. Uh, Hi, people. We're back inside now. Yeah, it's uh. It's, oh, dude, you smell. You smell like a. Sophisticated man. Is that what I smell like? Yeah, you smell like us. You, you smell, smell. You smell like old money. Like you drink out of a sniffer. <laughs> Kent and I were talking about houses we used to smell after frat parties. Oh yeah. <laughs> Do you have a smoking jacket? Like no. a real gent? Oh, we should get you one. Are you making of a cigar, cigar club? Smoking jacket. That brings too much class to it. I, I prefer to be garbage. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Gavin. I haven't seen you today. Hey yo! Yeah, what are you doing? Oh, you're pulling shit. You're shifting keys sat around. On my keys. Sat on your keys. Oh, did you bring that thing? I asked. Well, you said you were gonna I remind you. I said I was going to, and I forgot to remind I you. You could just that. say okay. what it is. A stick. I, I need one of those sticks that you change light bulbs like way high. I have like a 15 foot ladder, but I can't reach the light bulb that's like. Here's what you do. 30 feet above. You, get a you start finding ladder. things around your house and taping them together, <laughs> and, and put, put an a axe. real axe on the end of it, <laughs> and then just like a ball of tape. We did that. We did. Uh, it worked out great for moon balls. So Jack, did you? I bet you didn't hear what happened right before the podcast. Uh oh. Um, so remember when you all got P. Terry's today? Yeah. And then um, Sarah was like, "Jeremy, you didn't order anything." And I was like, "Oh yeah." I was like, "Oh yeah, you know, I am kind of hungry." And she was like, "Well, I haven't done the sport room order yet." Yeah, yeah. That, like sweet. So I put it in my order with her. She's like, "Cool." So I'm sitting outside, and I see her sipping on a shake from P. Terry's. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm like, "Hey, did you ever get the P. Terry's order for the support room?" And she's like, "Oh, there was an extra." Cheeseburger, that was yours, huh? We gave it to Alec. <laughs> <laughs> so Alec, like some like some sort of monster, <laughs> they're just like here eat. As some sort of monster. <laughs> so you, you got As some guy who got a free hamburger. Yeah. yeah. More than one. Man. So did he eat his own and then yours? I guess they Probably. no, they had an extra and he was like, Well, I guess I didn't get anything, so I'll have the burger. Hmm. Nice. Oh, he definitely had two. No, he, he had, had two. two. Okay. What? Oh, <laughs> yeah. 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 All right. He's a monster. Wow. They said he's the garbage is He is a monster. Going, they just push food under the door, door and he just <laughs> 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 The door Damn. rattles. 
So yeah, she weems it hard. Yeah, you got I hard weems. <laughs> Back us, what I understand is you got weems. <laughs> yes. A um, light weems in. Do you think she weems is once or twice a week? How many a weeks? week? I was gonna say once a day. day. Oh, she weems is every day. Yeah, I'll say, I don't know. We don't. I don't name. think we get full scope of her weems. All right. Yeah. Look. Before we go, to Sarah, if you're if you're listening, <laughs> I think you're doing a great job. I, I really she better be listening. No, I'm already, I already, I already you're told such a hard worker. I'm oh, wait, so oh, sorry oh, about oh. everybody else. Please don't quit because of them. I think about it all the time too. Trust me, it's difficult. She was. I <laughs> almost quit the Minecraft video the other day for Christ's sake. That's yes. true. You, you <laughs> did quit a Minecraft video. I quit the video, but I didn't quit the company. What? I don't know what happened. Yeah, to that was. Video. Get, all right, I wasn't in the mood for y'all yeah. bullshit. Oh, yeah. I mean, okay. It's not out yet. I have, I have a message from Sarah. Uh oh. Uh oh. As pertaining to. As pertaining? Is it the footage? As pertaining. The uh, footage. She's checked the footage. She's checked she checked the footage. footage. Uh, in the case vis a vis. Matt Bragg versus Gavin Free. A large number one, no pickles. Jer- I'm in there too. I'm a, I'm a defender. And, and defender. This is Jeremy. more like I'm uh, the judge. Jack, would you like to read the uh, bottom line? It says Sarah Weems, 2:42 p.m., uh, which was just a few minutes ago. <laughs> Looks like it was Gavin. <laughs> what? <laughs> What did he do? There goes Gavin. What did Gavin do? Gavin poured uh, uh poured the Orby, Orby things all over his desk. All over my desk. desk. Hundreds of them. Mm-hmm. Oh, the little things that you, the, the Orby, Orby yeah. things. Yeah, yeah, I heard about that. That Gavin did that yesterday. Yeah, yeah, he did it yesterday. I'm sorry, I wasn't listening to the conversation He's earlier. He's hard in denial about it. Yeah, yeah. yeah he He's did. He's trying it. to blame me for it. He's trying to get me back what, for all the Gmod what if murders. He's got like a legit problem where he just doesn't remember it. Oh, that's interesting. That's so possible. You think brain yeah. damage could explain it? It could be. Oh, I must be losing it. <laughs> that's the answer. <laughs> it's true. It's like memento. You gotta yeah. start writing shit you do, like put <laughs> Orbeez example, on Matt's desk across your Did chest. you forget where you were just going? Because you made it about 10 feet and turned around. <laughs> well, it's so far and it's so high out there. It is. <laughs> <laughs> Great point. Yeah. Remember when it was freezing like three days it won't ago? Save yeah. you, but I get that. Yeah, maybe we yeah. should take a look at the footage though instead of taking the Weems' as well. Sarah, well, yeah, no, she looked. She already got her Weems out today. We talked about that. She got she, she's Weems. <laughs> she Weems it all over the place. What are you saying? She Weeming twice in a day? You do have a point, though. You gave her a lot Look, of power. dude, you it's did it. Be responsible. That was Jeff, would you like to explain? No. <laughs> okay. That was for Jack. All right. for Jack. Jeff has a funny story that's a little too personal. Uh, it's uh, too funny for the... It's too good. Yeah, it's too funny. I'll tell it later. It's just too funny. Too funny. I think that's, that's going to be a, sta- a comedy night type deal or something like that, right? And there's going to be a stand Be set. responsible. Yeah, all right. Uh, so today is one of those glorious days of the year when a million big name games come out. Oh, right. Yeah. So some so, of them early. List them off. Uh, Far Cry New Dawn. Uh-huh. Crackdown Three. Uh-huh. Uh, Anthem for early access. That's true. Okay. And Metro Exodus. Oh shit! Did that actually come out today? Nice. Dude, I don't Anthem know. got a lot of hype. Sorry, that, 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 I don't know Force. anything about Metro. Something for Jump, Jump Force. Force. And we're also Metro playing Metro and also playing Tetris Ninety Nine. Awesome! I see it on TV all the Metro? time. The Metro trailer mm-hmm. on TV is fucking great. I'm, it might be really great. That I've game played, looks fantastic. I played Metro Twenty Thirty Three in. Um, and Last Light, which, yeah. and they were fun. Uh, I ruined the experience for me in Last Light because people were telling me like there's a good ending. It's one of those games where if you do like a lot of things over the course of the game, you get the good ending, yeah. including like not kill people. You have to like go. Well, through, where's like, the fun in that? Yeah, I don't get. No, and it really is way harder, and it takes out a bunch of like the shooting aspects. But I was really trying, and then I didn't get the good ending. Anyway. Uh, so oh, I tried, so I, like ruined the whole thing. I tried. Explain something to me. I tried to get into those games, and okay. the things that I couldn't, the thing that killed me for it was. A, they did the scarcity model with bullets, which works great for my t-shirts, but it's terrible when I need to kill Russians. Yeah. And uh, and then B, like every time I went outside, I died within 18 seconds, so I was always having to change my filters, and I was like, just You gotta change your filters, filters, big time. And, but then they fixed all that, right? Like they they, they changed the game to uh, to make it more like a just traditional FPS, is that right? It's, I think that they changed it to make it not as brutal. Like okay. the redux that came out is not as rough. You still have to change the filters. Yeah. And the thing with ammo is, I mean, I found plenty of it because if you just like take your time and scavenge around, you'll find <clears> a lot. Uh, but the ammo in that game is currency. Yeah, that's oh, okay. the, so. If you want to buy stuff, filters and things like that, you have to spend ammo to do it. Oh, wow. like, that's what they trade hmm. with. So that you have less bullets to fire, but now you have more. So if you, if you shoot at someone, you're paying them. You like you yeah. Shoot, yeah, <laughs> pretty, pretty much. Like, you're you're like a Chris Rock money. bit. Yeah. yeah, and there's like really good ammo. Oh, well, that's the thing. Oh, that's what it is. It's like not regular ammo isn't currency, but there's like gold ammo that's really good uh, and does a ton of damage. So it's like you're shooting. If you switch to that to take out speaking like speaking of the, shooting the monsters, you're shooting. You guys know there's a mass shooting going on right now in Illinois, right? Well, let's mm-hmm. just bring it all down, shall we? Well, I mean, it's, people are talking about I the know, chat. Yeah. So. Active shooter right now. Oh god, yeah. uh, I'm trying to trying to get to the trying to get news on it. 
Um, are you guys are you guys America. enjoying Apex or do you prefer I Blackout? If bullets were a currency, that wouldn't happen as often. That's true. I like That's Apex. True. It's different. Enough. Yeah, a lot of people yeah. like we've been playing Apex quite a bit. I know, like, got Alfredo. I, I've been watching Alfredo streams. It's just that fucker is a robot, man. Yeah, it's it's stupid how does good he is. play the robot too? Because uh, that would no, be too much play, robot. Wraith is his main. I think okay. someone on his team plays a robot. Yeah, I think someone's lifeline, someone's <laughs> Wraith, or he's Wraith, and then the others like, kind of changes around. We filmed an awesome Easter egg in that game yesterday that was so oh, much yeah. fun. Yeah, and it was a did. really uh, multi-part Easter egg. I can't believe we I'm got it. I'm amazed you guys yeah. did it so quick. We, got it. we, we, we filmed it Let's Play style, so hopefully that'll come out next week, but there's a thing in, I guess there's a Nessie Easter egg in Titanfall I was never aware of, where there's like a plush Nessie. Mm -hmm. And then so, yesterday Matt and, Tr and Alfredo and I did this thing where there's a, a plush Nessie in the map, on the map, in, in, yeah, uh, I'm, I'm a little confused no, it was, it was me, Matt, and Jeff. Oh, I'm sorry, it was Ryan. It doesn't feel great, does it? <laughs> well, no, no, because we started it with Alfredo. I'm used to it. it. was Alfredo for a while, and then it was Lindsay, and then it was Alfredo yeah, again. It's true. It was, oh, there was okay. a lot of switching in and out. It was a lot of switching in and out, but, uh, <clears throat> but yeah, so like, there's one spot that all, it always shows up, there's like a little Nessie, like in a pond of water, like, that you can go and shoot, and when you shoot that Nessie, another one appears. And when you shoot that one, a third one appears, and there's ten on the map, and they're always in the same place. And if you shoot all ten, then a giant Nessie comes out of the ocean, kind of like our Hitman Easter egg we did years ago, yep. which I, I rewatched this week. <laughs> Very funny. And, uh, if you haven't seen the Achievement Hunter Hitman Loch Ness Monster Easter egg, then... Apparently we got a poll You're going. You're a piece of shit. Yeah. Go see it. <laughs> Which Apex you prefer? Apex is gonna win that. Yeah, Apex no, yeah. easily. It's the new Apex shit. way better blackout. It is crushed. It's the other yeah. battle royale game. Right yeah, now. You, it's killing Fortnite. Fortnite. Yeah. But anyway, the hard thing about that is that you have to do it on the map when people mm -hmm. are playing, and so if anybody sees you, they're gonna kill you. And it's across the entire map, so we had to split it up into quadrants. And like Matt did three, and I did three, and Ryan did three uh, or four. So I think. And I then think uh, I ended up doing four because. I died early. Yeah, I died on died my last Ryan one. Yeah. I had the... to do four. I died on my fourth one. And is there, yeah. there's no time limit. You just have to do it before the round ends. You have to do yes. it before the round ends. But also when the, the circle shrinking, so as soon as you're outside the circle, you're dying. Yes. So you got to be really fast and good, and they're kind of hard to see. Which the last two were outside the circle, or the last one was outside the circle. Jeff died, so I was outside the circle. Had to run all the way into the middle of the circle to get the ninth one, so balloon, that it would the unlock balloon, the temple. Balloon, yeah. That was. <laughs> But yeah, so we did it, and we got it on our second try, and I thought it was going to take us so, six hours to do it. You do this well. Easter egg, this giant Nessie comes out, and everyone on the map can see this now. If they're there. so They, they like, just have to be, it's the I'm, far right coast. Yeah, it's far right, 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 right in front of me. So no, you I see that come out of the ocean, out. someone was doing some shit. Yeah. <laughs> People were hot at work. People what? were working. No, no, hey, Tyler. On this fucking which ad first? Uh, whichever one you want, man. Cool. Hey, Ryan, have you been sleeping well lately? Uh, I have. And oh, really? You know a lot about these, I think. I do. Good. This episode of Off Topic is brought to you by Casper. Casper is a sleep brand that continues to revolutionize its line of products to create an exceptionally comfortable sleep experience, one night at a time. Get $50 off select mattresses by visiting casper.com slash off topic and using promo code off topic at checkout. Casper's mattresses are designed by humans for humans. The original Casper mattress combines multiple supportive memory foams for a quality sleep surface with just the right sink and just the right bounce. Casper's breathable design helps you sleep cool and regulate your body temperature through the night, especially here in Austin, where some days it's 80 and some days it's 40 in the space of 24 hours. Buying Casper is easy. Order online, it's delivered to your door in a compact box, and you have free shipping and free returns in the U.S. and Canada. Jack, tell us about your mattress. I love my mattress. I've had it now for, God, probably about a year or so. It's super duper comfy. It's really, really nice. Like, it's it's got that, that perfect sort of balance of, like, compressed and, you know, soft and, and firm. Yes, Jeff. And correct me if I'm wrong, but you sleep every day. I do sleep. It's a thing sleep, you do daily. Would you I say, like, daily. a third of your life? I would say at least eight hours a day, which would equate to about a third of my life, Ryan. Interesting. Excellent. Well, considering we spend about a third of our lives on mattresses, it's important to truly sleep on a mattress before committing. Uh, that's why Casper gives you 100 nights to try it out. Get $50 towards select mattresses by visiting casper.com slash off topic and using promo code off topic at checkout. It's right here. Terms and conditions may apply. That's $50 towards select mattresses by visiting casper.com slash off topic and using promo code off topic at checkout. One of my favorite things Thank about you, the Casper mattress is that it comes in that box and you cut it and it goes poosh, poosh, and like fills up. We should get 70 of them and open them all in the same room. Oh, that sounds fun. Oh, and just like Watch the building let it go. Until we're all like yeah. gets trapped in the middle. That's what I <laughs> when that's the thing about Anthem is the the <clears throat> mechs or like the suits open up Weird. and you see inside like this padded structure and you can't imagine how a human would oh, squeeze yeah. into yeah, it. it but cute. it looks like a giant loving hug. It yeah. really does. <laughs> it's like, it's like, like stepping into a glove. Like you know like, your legs come out of it when you get out of your suit, you see it go like <laughs> Like it, oh, like really? it closes back up. Oh, like, wow. like oh, wow. It's really cool. Huh, that's cool. Um, Speaking of mattresses, my cat 
has decided that it's me. He's decided he will shit wherever Dan has been. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. He takes after you. He he, he, <laughs> he gets in the spare bedroom. It smells like Dan. He, he just shits all over it. And if Dan is like sat on a couch on the beanbag, he'll shit there too. Does do how Dan and Smee get along? <laughs> Not really. No. <laughs> I, mean, no I think that's how that works. I think we're onto something here. <laughs> yeah, my cat Reamer or no Coop last night threw up at four a.m. That was great. Really? And I have a thing like Uday. When Uday was like in the end, towards the end of his life, he started getting really sick, so he started throwing up a lot. And so I would just wake up immediately anytime I heard the. <laughs> Yeah, and so that's still ingrained in me now. So like Coop started doing this immediately just jolted awake and I was like, oh, and I heard him. <laughs> you, like, should, you should record him and set it as your alarm every morning. <laughs> <laughs> I'm like, oh. uh, yeah, uh, Smudge is now doing, uh, he's, he's been, he's the cat that always shits outside the litter box and now has decided that the, the downstairs bathroom is where he urinates. Uh, just, well, at least it's in the bathroom. Uh, I mean, it is. Damn. I don't you, know why he's so close. Have you tried one of those like kitty litter trainers, or like the toilet nah, trainer He's like things? a thousand year old. Oh, okay. I mean, he, he's also vomiting everywhere. The Roomba <laughs> got it once. <laughs> What's wrong with the Is it guys? possible it's Dan doing the shitting? <laughs> Blame it on the cat? No, Dan so... shits the litter box. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he knows what to do. Also, somebody said I look constipated in the chat. I have. You've missed the first part. He's oh, been yeah, shit no, he's on the toilet all day long. Yeah. The, the opposite of constipated. Shit. How much, Jeremy, for you to take your shit in a litter box and bury it? I would do it for free. <laughs> you would do it if I just brought in one, you would do it? I would it? shit in a litter box, just see what happens. What do you mean? What do you to happen? Yeah. Like, does the litter box. Is, is kitty litter uh, strong enough to hide human scents? Can it cover up a giant human turd? I'll do it. I mean, have it for free. Right I, I, here's what I want to know: Is there splashback? If I have a ploopy poop, does like <laughs> no. do I get like fucking do, do like little crystals pop back up and get in my dingleberries? Well, I want to know. Wanted you know, you got to bury it. I want to right? shit in a litter box. You got to bury it. Got to bury it too. Yeah, but the why thing do I is, to bury it when because that's part of it. Well, yeah, I'll do that. That's when, fine. When you squat, though, I haven't ever done it. Uh, shit in one of those squat holes. Yeah, yeah. But where does your pee go? Does it go straight down? Or does it come forward well, a bit? Point well, it, man. I mean, you have depends on where you're pointing. Yeah. yeah. I'm just, if I'm like this, though, is it gonna control the hose? Yeah. yeah. I don't I'd be you should get a squatty potty. Yeah. I can't do those. I, I can't do them. Really? Yeah, yeah. I've tried it and it just doesn't I've work. Never tried. Are you saying you can't survive in a world without it toilets? Work. No, 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 no. Like the like the, the squatty <laughs> potty in particular. Like yeah. something about having my knees up, I just can't like balance and get it. Comfortable. So <laughs> let's say society <laughs> balance tomorrow. It's not about being well, I'm fall about the toilet. Because you're like basically you become like a tripod at that point, where it's your <laughs> ass and your two feet up, but they're up <laughs> higher, and so. It's just you're I, I, on your ass and your two feet anyway. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're leaning forward. No, it's just your like legs. Like, no, no, because you because basically the whole idea is like your butt. Comfort. Your butt is like stri like just a point on it. Like it's, sure, you know, but usually you you sit on this point. Your legs are along the side of the thing, so you have more support that way. Right? I don't know what you're saying. Yeah. No. It's just, okay, when you're sitting in my, a chair. My feet are like this and I sit okay. down. Okay, see how you're sitting right now? Yes. See how your legs are also touching? Yes. And a squatty pot, your knees come up, <laughs> so it's just your butthole touching the, the or your, your ass. And your okay. back is on okay. the seat. It's your two yeah. cheeks, you know, like bouncing on your anus. He's like, saying like you're yeah, reducing about cheek contact. More than you do. I'm gonna go right into that fucker. The amount of comfy. cheek contact is dramatically decreased. Yeah, I'll give exactly. him that. exactly. Thank you. Look, look at her. See, that's... She looks fine. No, she still looks like she's Got thigh all the way. Yeah, she's she's got she's not yeah not doing she, right. She, I'll tell you what, that is a smiling yeah, it's, it's, shitter it's, it's, right there. Yeah. Well, it's not like it's it's not like stirrups. That that <laughs> I, that lady right there, you can tell that that went from an obligation to an event for her, which is <laughs> yeah, a good yeah. time. She also looks like she if she tries hard enough, she just blow the back of the toilet off. Yeah, I feel like just you like need lean a, up and go bam. You yeah. need an adjustable one. I think so. Like yeah. oh, I think maybe also my legs are longer. Never. Like my legs are longer, so they're going up higher than That's most normal humans. Attach it to like bike pedals in front of you to lift it, <laughs> <laughs> or have one of those like work the standing desks where it's motorized. And you just mm. yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, I wonder what the opposite would be like. Like, could you bolt the upright, take squatty, a shit? like standing, what? take you a just shit, stand like a pencil and just. <laughs> Like uh, so, yeah. Not, not, body, not, not sick, sick at all. I mean, kid, out, like, kids do it all the time. <laughs> would it come out like pasta, like <laughs> flattened, like through rollers? Did I ever tell you about the girl that used to know in the army? Work out, I guess. Did I ever tell you about the girl I knew in the army who got sick one time when she was a little kid and she peed and she said her vagina was all messed up and she peed spaghetti. Ah, yes, you did tell me. Yeah, yeah. you have, and yeah. I don't want to ever hear that word again. Yeah, it's so uh, gross. Spaghetti. Yeah, it is. It was Something like. Just, it was, was like solid. The urine was like solid nope. and stringy. Nope. And like, it so was she was already like told it. An, uh, an internal mold of her. Did she yeah. bury it? <laughs> Bladder hole. I don't know if she bury it. I mean, it. she might have. You gotta figure that out. Oh man, yeah. on that train of thought, I had carbonara. She last was night. racist. <laughs> <laughs> carbonara is I'm actually, so good. I've been eating a lot of spaghetti. It's good. I watched like I watched several videos on how to do it properly. <laughs> 
Came out really did good. Did you say you did it wrong though? I think I, I, I think I put the I put eggs in at the end like a little too early because it needs mm. to be just the right heat that you put the eggs in. It codes it and then it cooks a little bit, but doesn't like scramble. So you had the Valentine's at uh home. -huh. Yep, Valentine's at home. I mean, it's, I just feel like it's not worth it anymore. Yeah, it's like, shit's just so busy on Valentine's Day. It's like yeah, eh, fuck it. I got Katie some plants. Like instead of flowers, <laughs> I got like she is. She likes plants, so I got her, like a little like uh, uh well, not bamboo. What's yeah, the word? Bonsai. Plant. Bonsai tree. Yeah. Sorry. What plows? Flowers. flowers yeah. <laughs> and then, yeah, then we plant. plowed. Right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you, what did everybody do for Valentine's Day? What did you do for Meg for Valentine's Day? Stayed in. Yeah? yeah. Do you guys have, did you cook for her or anything? Or <laughs> we, have, we have a tradition. Food? We always have spaghetti and we always watch a classic movie. So we I watched will, Goodfellas. Oh, nice. okay. I will say this. Up until Wednesday, Meg and I were streaming together Thursday night. And I was like, you know, that's Valentine's Day, right? And she's like, huh. Oh. Yeah. All right. I guess maybe we won't do it. <laughs> <laughs> I, I went to Uchiko with my girlfriend and had a lovely dinner. And then I went the next night with Millie. Double nice. Uch. Yeah. Because? Uchiko two nights in a row. Because Millie, uh, she's my other Valentine. Aww. So I wanted to be a good dad. So That's I not how you told the story last time. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, I also, <laughs> well, well, I also, I wasn't sure which night I'd be free, so I booked two nights, and then I had the second night booked, and I was like, Millie loves Uchiko, yeah. so throw it away. I told yeah. you what Katie yeah. did for me, right? So for Valentine's Day, uh, I just finished reading Eddie Izzard's autobiography. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Eddie Izzard's oh, yeah, yeah. great. Yeah. And I tweeted about it. There's one passage in particular that's really beautiful. And I, I tweeted about it. And then um, I was, it was funny. I, I looked at his Twitter account, and he's doing a tour right now. And not only is he doing a tour, but he's currently in Australia and in New Zealand. And he's playing the State Theater in Sydney and the Perth Concert Hall in Perth, where the two <laughs> venues we played when we did Age Live, which is... Freaking awesome! I hope they cleaned up all the mayo. <laughs> <laughs> and then I was looking. He's like, "Oh, he's coming to Austin in June," but like, I don't think Katie was going to be in town. I was like, "Oh, I mean, I'll look at it later." And then that, like, so the next day, I, I got my Valentine's gift. Katie bought us tickets to see Eddie Izzard in Washington D.C. in May, oh, like when she's so cool, when she's dude. out of school. So we're going to go fly up to D.C. and go see Eddie Izzard. Now, aren't you going to be sad when school. it turns out that he slips and breaks his knee on just random mayonnaise? On the <laughs> 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 That's true. Like, <laughs> like oh yeah, sorry about that. But not. Like I'm excited. Heel breaks. So <laughs> we're gonna go. We're gonna go to DC for a few days and like go nice. Air and Space Museum and a few other things. Did he awesome. talk in his book about his ridiculous running? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He, he did. Uh, he did 26 marathons and 20 or no, 27 marathons oh in 27 god. days. Yeah. Oh and, my god. But not only that, but he did. It wasn't all like there was one day he had to take off because he got sick, and so he did a double marathon one day. Oh. Where he ran one in the morning and one in the evening. No, there, there and are and those, legs not. And there then on the last day, I think the last day he did a marathon and then another 6K because there's like some there's a thing in South Africa or in Africa where they do like a super marathon, and so for his last one he did that one. They're too, called just super for, marathons. And they're yeah. a really big deal. Yeah. yeah, I read an article about a dude who was from Austin actually, who ran super marathons, and they were saying like you have to ingest so many calories that he and he got so good at it that he would order pizzas from Domino's to like <clears throat> intersections that he knew he'd be running to in 30 minutes, <laughs> and he would meet the pizza guy there, and he would fold up a large pepperoni pizza and eat it like this while oh. he was running. Wow. Oh. Because you need to eat like 15,000 yeah. calories a day to live. Because mm -hmm. running because like a super marathon's like. Two or three marathons, something like back that. to back to back. But but he's, he's done that a few times. Too. Yeah, yeah, he's done, he's done that a few times. He did one in England actually, where he ran around England, um, like up like to, from London to like Wales, up to Scotland, and then back. Um, that was his first time he did. There's a charity. It's like a sport charity. He does it for in England. I forget the name of it, but it's really really cool. It's a really good book. I love. I, really I love. Right that, that's it. That's it. That's the one. Um, I love autobiographies and I love biographies. I just love reading about people. I'm off books. Are you? You're yeah, I'm taking, a, I'm taking a break. I mean, uh, no, I'm not done. I just like every once in a while you need to mix it up, and I have just been I was over reading for a while, and so I I always pendulum swift too far one so way or the other. What are you mix it up with? What's the alternative to I've been, books? I've been playing Apex, and I've been watching a lot of TV, a lot of self. And uh, I I'm reading I, I'm actually reading. Uh, Furious Matt. Have you read? I'm getting back into drinking. I'm reading, <laughs> I'm reading one comic book right now. Seriously, it's pretty good called Saga. Have you read Saga? Uh uh Yeah, it's Brian K. Vaughn's. It's supposed to be like his like epic. I don't know. Like, it's like the Game of Thrones of comic books right now. It's really good. I'm enjoying that. That's cool. But yeah, I was thinking about the other day. I was like, I haven't finished a book in two months, maybe. Wow. Yeah. Which is a long time for me. Yeah, you were but, tearing through them. Like, yeah, I just, it's every once in a while you need to take a break. You get burned out. It's, but like, you, it's like the Howard Stern thing. I will listen to Howard Stern five hours a day every day for six months, and then I won't listen to him for six months. And then go back in again. But you did the thing where you're reading, like, physically reading half, about half, and then listening to some? Or no. did you read everything? No, I physically read everything. Okay. Yeah. 
Uh, I tried to do something sweet for Valentine's Day for Laurie, and uh, it lasted about 30 minutes. <laughs> really? Yeah, yeah. Well, no, that's, I, that's pretty impressive, sex, right? Yeah. <laughs> hey, hey. Not bad. No, not I, bad. I got her some flowers. It's some very nice flowers. It's like a hundred dollar arrangement thing of Ooh. roses and stuff. And was, uh, she was she was called me when she got up. She's like, oh, thanks for the flowers. Can't have them in the house. Got to yeah, get rid of these. Kill the cats. Yeah, yeah they yeah. had some lilies in there, and she's like, any bit of that lily, just a uh, cat murder immediately. So oh, she, lilies <laughs> are bad for cats. Oh yeah. Oh, I don't know. Yeah, I can. I can never <laughs> well, get huh. any. That's Katie's roses. favorite favorite flower. I well, <laughs> I mean, so. my argument is all right. The cats ex cats exist in nature, and lilies exist in nature. They didn't exterminate the cat species by existing. Cats, the, you most of them don't know. The pollen like really clogs them up. To be fair, she yeah, that's a bad. It's well. real bad. But most I, flowers are bad for cats. <laughs> I know that's what I was saying. It's like I looked it up. It's like every flower is except for roses. I don't really care. I bought, <laughs> I, bought, I, bought I bought cat flowers. There's like roses in there, and there's like there's sunflowers in there, but they were like dyed sunflowers. Like so, I guess if the sunflower is like in. Water with dye, it like yeah. soaks that up, and then so the huh. sunflowers turned like red. Oh, that's cool. Which that's is like really cool looking. But then like so, you know, the cats will jump up on the table every now and again, be sniffing at it, or like kind of munch on it, and I'm like, get the fuck out of here. So then like during the day when we go to work, we just put them in the bathroom. <laughs> put the flowers in the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> our, our master bathroom has like all of Katie's plants that aren't hanging because yep. the cats will annihilate all of them. Are you guys excited about next week? Yes. Dude, we're gonna go do two ghost hunts next week. Yeah, we're doing so two. I'm only doing excited. one. Excited. Apparently, it's gonna be very cold. It's gonna be yeah, in the twenties. They were telling yeah. us. That we oh, it's down to the twenties now. Stuff. Yeah, Shit. and okay. it's gonna be wet the whole time, and we're gonna be in a wet place. Damn, I won't give anything away. <laughs> that's but the, that's the sequel to a weird place. Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> the wet place. We're ghost hunting in a swamp. I was thinking about that because I because I actually I turned down three trips this week and next week. Uh, I was going to do this film festival for Waiting for the Punchline, and then I had a thing in Atlanta, like an executive thing, and then I had uh, I, wa I really wanted to go to the Funhouse 4th anniversary party that's happening today. Oh, I don't um, know. I didn't but I was just like, I was just like looking at all the flights and stuff, and I was so exhausted, and I was thinking like, and I got to go to do two ghost hunts next week. How am I going to have the energy? And I'm like, why am I so fucking tired? It's only February, and then I thought about everything we've done this year <laughs> yeah. already. 2019 has been insane. We did a yeah. ghost hunt in Australia. We did a full Australian tour across the entire country. We filmed the entirety of the thing we did that's like hardcore, mm -hmm. like that yeah. hardcore season thing. I don't know what to call it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I don't want to misspeak and call it the wrong thing. Uh, we did, we started... I don't know if we've talked about this. We did a fucking heist yesterday. Yeah, we did. Wow, we've been teasing it, but no one said what it was. Oh. Oh, hey. <laughs> we did a heist. <laughs> we did a heist. Hey, heist. Heist. Bring them back. We Bring did a heist, but um, we actually have a couple planned. So yeah, yeah, that's yeah. why I thought we should just say it's a new season of heist. It's a new season yeah. of heist. Yeah, we're just going to do a season, season, season two of heist. heist. Yeah. And the way we shot the first one, it kind of, is, it kind of le like lends thematically into the next one, which I like. Yeah. Um, Hardcore redact. I feel like we're getting more theatrical <laughs> with stuff as we go on. We, we want the heist to be more of a thing. Like kind of connected in a certain yeah, way. Yeah, yeah. And like, we, I was thinking about today, like this, I, I mean, A, it was super fun to do a heist again, and that was really exciting. Uh-oh, people like the, the heist. Three, <laughs> like, there were three separate live action components to this one heist, which yeah. is When's it totally out? new. Is it? It's not this Look, week. I don't it's know. not this, I don't think it's this week, I think it's the week after. Yeah, this, this week this is, is the RC. fuck around that's yeah. really funny. The RC oh, yeah. car fuck oh, around. Yeah, yeah. Oh, oh yeah. The, okay, the RC <laughs> car fuck around is one of the funniest <laughs> fuck arounds we've done in a while. I headed to the airport. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I smell the human. Room. Part of it. <laughs> Part, Part of it's of it, at the airport. It. Yeah, it, it does. Most of it. Most of it's at the airport. End, it ends not at the airport. It ends pretty funny. Yeah. Uh, yeah, it was a lot of fun. The fucking Velociraptors. <laughs> uh, <laughs> it was. I, I feel like we've done other big stuff already this year, too. I feel like I had a lot I of work in January. Stuff. Yeah. yeah. We we no, got, I still, I think I'm missing something. We, we just got out of a meeting done. with like two or three pretty big things that are happening later this we year. We are oh, like dude, 46 no days into this year. That is no <laughs> joke. Jack and, and Trevor and I just lobbied for us to do a lot more work later in the year. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then we just volunteered, yeah. sorry, we just volunteered to Shima to do a bunch more work. Technically, We'll Me, you, and Trevor have to go film a pilot for something after this, too. Oh, God, are you well. doing that today? Oh, yeah, uh, today? I think, I think yeah. we're doing that today. If we I got to, I got to, what time? I got to leave. I don't know. It's going to be a short like podcast. Sorry, like everyone. Four. What time are you leaving? I guess I'm staying to do that. <laughs> <laughs> should only be like 10 minutes, hopefully. I'll talk to Trevor. Or Trevor we could shoot Anthem instead. Or you can do that uh, and Anthem. Or mm -hmm. I can shoot Anthem with you. They can we go can do, do that. the first thing of, We uh, did Tetris uh, 99. Oh, we filmed that. The Tetris that was oh, yeah, awesome. We shot, we shot Tetris 99 yesterday. Which was super fun. So it starts with a Let's Watch Jack and then Jack You need to be over. one of the uh, the smaller robot people. 
There's four classes in yeah. Anthem. Ryan went oh, with okay. like the normal. <laughs> I went with the like, Ranger, which the is Ranger, like, uh, it's like your the everyone. Okay, yeah, I'm gonna go with I went with the giant one, of course, right? Because I want giant Remy to run in to places. <laughs> I can't make him that color yet. I'll go home and play that tonight. And then there's like really... a warlock looking one. Okay. Like he looks like the warlock from Destiny. Oh, cool. Okay. Uh, and then there's one that's like a speed based, like one. a scouty, and it's like like really. Somebody's breaking in your so, so I should be. It's cash. I should be the call. slim one, or I should be the which, warlock. Which one do you want? Probably Either. warlock. I mean, I, I played warlock I all throughout that's Destiny. So yeah. is it similar to Destiny? And yes, what it, is? it looks very similar. It looks beautiful. It's, it's, it's got uh, like a lot of the mechanics in the. You've got a grenade that is a rechargeable ability rather than a stun. Oh, the same with melee. Um, then you also have an ultimate ability. So a lot of the mechanics for gameplay, uh, yes. But I think the movement system feels really good. Flying you play around on and PC or console. I was playing on PC because Some, PC is it's out. I'm on console. There's there's a, console. a lot of there's a lot of console. asterisks about its release. It's it's crazy. Yeah. So on is PC, is this the game they released that chop? Yeah, for us so you can yeah. Tell yes. what yeah. You yeah. Eighty different ways. You on PC, if you're an Origin Premier member, it's free and uh, out today. You can it's just get the whole thing and right now. How much now. does that cost? Fifteen, 15 bucks a bucks. month or a hundred dollars a year. Yeah, we all signed up. Much, we all signed up for it today. I it's went, I went not cheap. I, I'm just gonna buy the game. I mean, well, to, here's the thing: if, me, you get a hundred bucks a year, you yeah. get every game. Like, but if you years. already have, have you already pay for it on the fucking. I already pay for EA Access on the Xbox. Well, if you pay yeah. for EA Access on the Xbox, then you can play. You can load it and play it today, but only like the first part of it. Only for ten hours. Only for ten hours. Yeah, the early access trial. Which is weird. And there, if you have a PlayStation, fuck, fuck you. You. <laughs> <laughs> you can't touch it until it's released. Yeah. Because they don't have EA access or. I will say, what was that stream we did? You guys were, you guys did that. <laughs> no, but we love that's you. Like, that's not a fuck we, you from us. It's not yeah. fuck you from EA. EA's I, saying fuck. Yeah. You guys looked like you were having fun in that stream today, though. Yeah. Yeah. We had a lot of fun. I yeah. never, I never played Prey. Past Prey the first is level. so fun. Yeah. yeah. It's it's a really good game. The new game we played today is actually pretty cool. Moon sharks. Fucking moon sharks. Is there a different Prey? So you, yeah. DLC. DLC. Yeah. Do, do you remember from the original, no, the original Prey, from the base game, uh, the Nightmares, like yeah. the giant phantoms? Those, but covered in moon rocks, and they go under the ground. Oh, shit. Those are moon sharks. Yeah. And they're blind, so if you, it's like tremors. You walk it's on the very ground. very tremors. I, I think enough time has passed that I could do a whole other run of Prey. And do yeah? Like, well, well there's, a, there's, there's achievements so for doing, like, right now. Yeah, moon, yeah. moon crash is very different. Yeah. Moon crash, the DLC that we played just t today, was, it's like there's a, a, a smaller area, and you run through it multiple times with different characters to find different exits and unlock different things, and, and it's like a point-based system where you're it the things you do. Reason. Yeah, it you're expected to die. I actually the points I got at the end of that more than replaced what I spent going into it. So yeah, that yeah. was not necessarily a negative result that I got. They uh yeah, but I mean there's there's so many games coming out right now like replaying a game. <gasps> I mean, you could, yeah. But like I've I've oh already beat I beat. New Dawn, Far Cry New Dawn. I'm missing one achievement that I gotta figure out. Fucking Far Cry. Yeah. yeah. And yeah, then no. I just beat Cracked Out. <laughs> so you beat two games that came out have you today. Guys, have you guys, <laughs> That's pretty had, cool. Had you guys good? talked about Crack, the... Okay. Cracked Out. Like, just, just, which we just streamed on Wednesday. Yeah. Which we just streamed on Wednesday. Which pretty universally, one was good, two was pants. Right. This is very similar to one. Uh, <sighs> Very fun to run around in and like not pay attention. Like, and I know that kind of sounds insulting, but I'm, I don't want it to. I love games like that where I can just run around and, and do stuff and maybe be listening to something, just collecting yeah. things. <clears throat> Obviously, Crackdown's like that. There's either five or seven hundred agility orbs, uh, agility orbs, and there's an achievement for getting all of them and no map. But, oh. they, but they're and stationary this time. They're stationary. There's no ping either, as far as I can tell. Oh, do. really? Yeah. Oh, that's, that sucks. Yeah, it's just like there's different sections of the map, and they're like, you yeah. have 30 out of 50 in this section. That's a huge okay. bonus. When you open the map, can you see the yeah. ones you're missing? Can you? Does it, or do you have to be in the area and collect one? You see on the map. Okay. I would, um, I'm going to play Crackdown 3 just to get the orbs. It's just fun. It's yeah. Yeah. And it's just very fun because you play as tiny Terry Crews. And you get better as you about, go, And then, right. like, so now I'm, like, huge Terry Crews again. Um, but... <laughs> Oh, he would keep calling Tiny Terry. Tiny, Tiny Terry, Terry is, at his smallest, yeah. is larger than any of us. He's <laughs> like a football <laughs> linebacker yeah. already. Um, but the the worst thing about the game, unfortunately, is driving. The driving mm. is just not good in it. Like it just doesn't feel right. And it always well, the, the game, me the game feels me. very light. Like the characters yeah. feel very light. The cars feel very light. It just feels like a light game. I'm not saying it's a bad thing. There's like no. you know, like you go back and play like GTA 4, all the cars just slid like exactly. crazy. Exactly. Like five it's nailed. Like, yeah, driving, five did really good like, in driving. Done a great job. So and, like they all have their differences and stuff. But yeah, this so game, this one's very slippy, sliding, yeah, yeah. and shit like that. But you got like the spider car which jumps onto buildings and then just drives up them mm -hmm. and stuff like that. It's it's just a dumb. <laughs> Fun game, yeah. Uh, and then I love Far Cry New Dawn. Yeah. I thought mm -hmm. New Dawn was excellent. 
You know, I was. Did, have you guys? Uh, Terry Tate, office linebacker. Hell yeah. We were talking about that yesterday for some reason. Ooh. Has uh, uh, who's the guy that didn't do the TPS reports? Richard. <laughs> do you TPS reports, Richard? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, if anybody right. doesn't know what Terry Tate, office linebacker, is, and you probably don't if you're under forty because it's old ass internet, <laughs> was that, you should was that a Google Super Bowl it and find it. Uh, I think it was a Super Bowl. I, you might be right. It might have been. Yeah, there were, there were like four of them, it. and there it ended. I think the last one was in Germany. I just remember uh, watching because he was Coltrane too. Yeah, in Gears. Yeah, but oh, it's fucking he? great. Mm-hmm. Why not? Um, uh, it makes sense. But uh, you guys are talking about Far Cry New Dawn. Have you yeah. guys watched any of the new Inside Gaming content yet? No, not the first, first episode no, came out just today, happened today, right? right? No, it happened yesterday. I watched um, <laughs> last night. I watched. They did. Uh, I mean, I watched. Their, they did like, a review of their little announcement videos, but I watched their Far Cry review, which. I I thought it was really it was like 15 minutes and I was just gonna pop in for like a second just to like get a to- get the tone of it and see what the content looks like and I ended up watching the whole fucking thing I thought it was super interesting. What did they think of it? It was Adam Lawrence and Alana and uh, they weren't crazy about it. I, have a, it I had a feeling generic. they wouldn't like it. And I uh, <clears throat> and I'll be honest with you, like I disagreed with having not even played the game. I disagreed with their assessment of it uh, mm-hmm. based on just things they said about the previous games, but. It, that, Something about, and Adam and Alana are fine, but something about Lawrence, it, you could just listen to Lawrence talk about video games he knows for like lot. 10 hours, because yeah. he he's so well-versed yeah. and he's so smart, and even when you don't agree with him, he's, his points are like well thought out and very salient and interesting, and he's, you can tell the guy has, not to fucking suck Lawrence's dick all day, but the guy has so much <laughs> passion about what he does that he's just like fun to listen to talk about stuff that he gives a shit about. And I did, I, I think I will disagree if I, after I play Far Cry with his assessment, but it was just, it was just like the 15 minutes just went like, it like, felt like a three minute video. And I was like, how the fuck have I been here for a quarter yeah. of an hour? I somehow watched so. that, the introduction to Inside Gaming like three different times. Really? Because they have the like a condensed version on Twitter and then they had one on the site and I ended up, I was like, oh, this must be a different video. And it was the same video. I was like, yeah. I still watched the whole thing. Like those guys are just, they're, they're just, funny. They're, they, they work, they mesh so well together in that that sort of realm. You know, we're, we're not good at, uh, Complimenting our our peers and coworkers. That's really not. Oh, yeah. I mean, that's not our wheelhouse. That, that being it's said, not the fuck business, those guys. It's not fuck the business we yeah. trade in, you know. And obviously, we're a thousand times better than them on our worst day. <laughs> but uh, <laughs> <laughs> that got worse and worse as you said. But <laughs> really piled up high. Yeah, yeah. I mean, Woo. but uh, we got a lot to live up to. Uh, let me just say this. Day. Let me say this. In the fun house. They're the kind of guys and girls that if they shit in a litter box, they w- they, they they wouldn't cover it up. No. Yeah. Yeah. They're not buried. <laughs> they they're just they gonna leave it. it out there for God and everybody to see, uh, yeah. and then they're gonna brag about how great their shit is. But, uh, but no. But it, I really, I fucking check it out. If you weren't aware that the no transitioned to inside gaming, uh, and if you haven't seen uh, any of the content, like I recommend just watching that Far Cry fifteen minute deep dive video they did, just because it's really interesting and it's I, I, I assume it's indicative of things to come. Yeah. So if you like that, maybe you'll like more stuff. If and you don't like that, you might hate. Yeah. All the content and, coming after that. And but. they've been working on this stuff for a few months But it's now. been going like, on for a while, yeah, they've been, they've, behind the scenes. Yeah, and so it's finally like hitting and launching, and like they've got a lot of cool stuff planned. So. Is okay. come keto-friendly? As far as I know, it is. It could be. I don't it's know. Try it and find if out. If there's one thing, too, that we can say about Funhouse is that they don't know what size clothing to wear. Yeah. Uh, and so here, this might actually help them out a little oh, bit. Oh, yeah, 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 right. Uh, right. This episode of Off Topic is brought to you by Stitch Fix. Stitch Fix is an online personal styling service that finds and delivers clothes, shoes, and accessories to fit your body, budget, and lifestyle. Stitch Fix is the best. The sign-up experience is super easy, and you get cool items sent right to your door. Just go to stick... Stop it. I didn't do anything. I know. I feel it. Just go to stitchfix.com slash offtopic and tell them your sizes, what styles you like, and how much you want to spend on each item. You'll be paired with your very own personal stylist who will handpick items to send right to your door. It really is that easy. Uh, I think Michael's used it. Um, and, uh, you know, he's... Looking pretty well dressed lately. Yeah, he doesn't do bad. And when he shows up to work, you know, <laughs> uh, you try them on, pay for only what you like, and return the rest. Shipping, exchanges, and returns are always free. No subscription required. You can sign up, receive scheduled shipments, or get your fix whenever you want. Stitch Fix's styling fee is only twenty dollars, which is applied toward anything you keep from your shipment. Get started now at stitchfix.com slash off topic, and you'll get an extra 25% off when you keep all items in your box. That's stitchfix.com slash off topic to get started today. Stitchfix.com slash off topic. Thanks for supporting this podcast. Thank you. 
All right, my Twitter is blowing up because they tweeted something about the new theater mode coming out. Oh, really? Oh. Uh, we, yeah, this, we have a clip from that, actually. <laughs> Not to go from one promo into another promo, but we do have a clip. It's the squeeze play one. Oh, is it? Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. oh my god. Oh, I'm squeeze sorry. play? It's oh, yeah. Oh, man. Never mind. Roll the clip. Oh, <laughs> no. No. Really, yeah, you know what? Just, if you have it ready, then just roll it. That room is a pigsty. It's not great. Well, can I get you a drink? Sure. What do you got? You got any beer? Oh, this dude's Jeremy. Here we go. <laughs> oh! <laughs> I'm done. Ten I'm years done. and you just saw Jack's greatest moment in Achievement Hunter history. Wow. Jack, why don't you go ahead and take your victory lap? That now. was that was amazing. Awesome. Uh, yeah. Jeremy, you didn't have to look, but it happened again. Yeah. Three. Just oh man. You're really getting into it now, aren't you, baby? Now that guy had hair. That's a different guy. Outer. No! <laughs> Dude, no one loves that clip more than theater mode. What's up, man? You wow. need to be stopped. You use that. <laughs> no, man. No, no, you're doing a great job. Keep up the good work. Thanks, man. Three can years. Get, can man, we get that on? I used to be fucking fat. Can we I get that on a hockey? Can yeah, yeah, get a button and it'll pop up on the stream? Sure, why not? the stream. That'd be great. <laughs> that, was, that was like one of those, you know, off, top, uh, off topic. On the spot for a while, I had those extra cards you'd play during a game. Like, and you had to, ch well, you, yeah, fuck it. Yeah. Anyone who was on, you. I know, I know. So, yeah. <laughs> they had like the extra cards. You'd have to do something. The like diddle cards. Them. Yeah. Diddle, diddle cards, diddle cards yeah. Jesus uh, Christ. So it the was diddle cards? Diddle yep. cards, yeah, because they had the finger on it. Here's the schedule, by the way, if you're watching. Uh, so oh. what day are we on? We're on 2.15. 2.15. So we got Fraternity Demon coming up. That's we got Sizzle Beach USA, which was Kevin Costner's first movie, I think, or first Don't big movie. That yeah. One. Yeah. And then yep. Cry Uncle. Yeah. Cry Uncle is the first straight up pornography that in is, theater mode. I don't don't watch that if you have problems with naked. Don't yeah. watch it with your parents. Naked boys, naked, naked yeah. girls. Not, a, not good naked naked. Boys. Not one of those things yeah. you want to watch with your mom and dad. So anyway. Well, well, I'm gonna don my suit of armor for a squeeze play coming out. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, actually that reminds me, Tyler said he had a bonus clip. Clip of you from Squeeze Play. What? Yeah. Oh, no. I don't know what it is. Did you, you, did you, did you yeah. really? Yeah, let's yeah, see it. Just one extra clip. One extra clip. What is it? Yeah. So that's how. What the no, fuck? I can tell us no! No! <laughs> no! Celebrating the men. I will film a sequel myself where Yay! the women win. Men! <laughs> 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 I Dream spent the whole men. time cheering on men instead of women. Finally, yeah. it's our turn. Yeah, that's it what I'm saying. I was like, we finally get one, men. And as much as you can you uh, they claim that that movie has a plot, it's that the men's team is is going to play the women's team. So And there's yeah. a random wet t-shirt contest in there. Yeah. This is my favorite Dungeons and Dragons show. Yeah. Um, uh, mm. I think they stream it on uh, some other channel. Yeah. Uh, yeah, that's uh, you know nothing to announce yet, but it hasn't been forgotten. I'll say that things are in process. There you go. Spoiler. I don't, I don't know. If that means it'll ever be a show again. I don't even know what that. Means. You guys forgot about ten grams. You're, you're not. There's, you're not in it. It's okay. Oh, okay. All right. <laughs> oh, did I'm ten grams have porn in it, or was it just nudity? I don't remember. Ten, ten grams. Oh no, it had straight up porn. Had straight up inside a vagina. Oh really? I ten grams. Oh, was yeah. where that British stripper lady was like. Oh yeah. Okay. This is it's, where the penis goes. And the baby comes out. But there's actual like penetration, I think. In, yes. We saw in, her, yes. dude. She put her finger in her. We saw her. Okay, I didn't see, insert I, a I finger there into her one. vagina. So in, in this other years. one, a pe you actually see two people have I sex. I think it was. I think it was oral it, uh, sex. You, you see a blowjob. You, you may see some pegging. Some peg. Oh, really? <laughs> yes. Yes. That. Yeah. You see a blowjob like brown bunny blowjob, like Chloe's pegging? pegging. He's got a dick in her mouth. Yes. What's pegging? Nice. Yes. What do you think yeah. pegging is? Dick. Okay. Okay. Close. Dick in the eye. What is it? In the yeah. eye. Dick in the eye. That's it. No, it's when you have sex with a pirate. Yeah. Very splintery. 
It's when a girl puts on a dildo and fucks you in the ass. Yes. Which is oh. hanging. A Netflix show you, by... It, okay. it's, I, I understand no, why Gavin can get it. It's a British thing. <laughs> Gavin calls it Megging. Oh, oh yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, if we would have uh, just called it that, you would have known right away. Someone said a Netflix show with uh, Polygon and Art Rooster Teeth coming out. Yes, that we uh, we announced the uh, Transformers, Transformers thing. Yeah. So we're working with uh, Polygon and, Megan and, Megan and uh, Megan. for a Netflix good. Transformers. Thanks, real good. Thanks. Pretty really cool. Good. It's pretty neat to be involved with a fucking franchise like Transformers. Transformers! That's crazy to think about. 2019 is a big Rooster Teeth year. Yeah. Yeah. A lot going on. That's another one of those things that we've known about for quite a while that it's like, <clears throat> Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's pretty badass. I mean, fucking Jesus. And Ginlock's tearing along. We're halfway through Ginlock right now. Yeah, we are. It's a fucking great show. It's really, really good. Uh, what else? That's it? All right. Oh, there's, look, Ginlock. There we go. That's the show I just mentioned. <laughs> that is. Why oh, is it? Man. Everything's off center right now. What? what you mean? The, also, look, look at the, the screen, resolution like, on that thing. Looks fine on the camera. Uh, it's fine. Yeah. There, but look at is it? Yeah, look. Yeah, Gavin's no, ruining the center. I don't know what the fuck's going well, on. What am I doing? I don't think. Yeah, 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 it's not just me. Look at look yeah. at the look at the look screen. At the space behind me. I'm not, look I'm at the not screen. Ahead. Here's the center of the of the frame, and it's way way low. We center to the cast. Fuck you. <laughs> 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 well, cast can center to the to the camera. Come on, that's how it works. Anyway. Oh, doing Don't say Jeff yeah. voices anything. There Talk. you go. All right. See, that looks good. Think about how many Rooster Teeth productions you've seen Jeff do a voice in outside of Red vs. Blue. I don't ever get to be in shit. We were in uh, X-Ray Nevada. Were you? They had to put me in that. I was terrible at <laughs> it. It was, I was, in, I was so want? bad. What do you want? I'm not complaining that I'm not, I'm not in stuff because I'm not good at it. <laughs> you were in Bloodfest? Yeah, they cut my scene down. All right. <laughs> were you in Bloodfest? Yeah. Man, that's we, the same scene you are. We're 11 days away from Trials. I'm excited. I had to film we are the death scene. Yeah. I filmed it the next day. Trial, trials is open beta next week. Is it really? Mm -hmm. oh, wow. Only 21st through 23rd. For yeah. EA members, but then if you're not an EA member, but if you're an Origin Act, no. <laughs> you play. Be a you play yeah. member. Uh, very, very pumped for that. Gavin and I are already planning out some stuff, possibly. There is a there is a tandem bike in the new Trials game. That oh, yes. Gavin and I can get to some shenanigans on that one. So. Too bad we're not here next week. All right. Uh, well, you were, uh, week, I mean, it? maybe Beta's you were Luffy oh, Lupe. Yeah, right. Little Lupe. You were Little, little Lupe. Lupe. Remember? Little, 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 just Google, Google, Google. I was Little Lupe. Just, My pussy is a machine. Just, just, just Google Jeff Ramsey, Little, little Lupe. Lupe. Yeah, don't just, do that. There just make sure to be able to link them so anytime you search for Jeff Ramsey. If you're going to Google it. Little Lupe, don't do it in front of your mom or your dad. It's all yes. the stuff we tell people not to do in front of their parents. Incognito window, Little Lupe. What you do is you make sure you, you uh, associate your phone with your... your uh, Echo in your house, and then look up Little Lupe. Yeah. Was it Little Lupe? I'm from Georgia. Little Lupe. Did we see oh. the copyright strike Landon got? I saw that he got. Oh, yeah. Right. Well, he's going to stop fucking stealing other people's content and he yeah. won't get the copyright Hi, strike. Here's a, here's a, here's a tip. Don't be a fucking Australian thief. <laughs> yeah. He got, he got a copyright strike thief. from a guy who has. Also, don't uh, cry about drinking had, beer on stage next time. He got a copyright strike from a guy who had, I think, one video and like no subscribers. He took the video? Uh, and yeah, he took the video. And so now he's like fighting. He's, he's claiming he's going to take the guy to court. Look, I don't get it back. Use yeah. the guy's video. No, 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 uh, no. Get it. It's just a, it's a bullshit a, claim. I have, a, I have a lot to thank Landon for because I never thought I'd out drink an Australian until he was on stage with us in oh Sydney. Oh my god. <laughs> he... <laughs> I think he was the only person who got booed by <laughs> <laughs> Well, he was representing his entire country the, to, by going, his... oh, a second. And then he lays down. In his defense, we were tag teaming booze, and he was doing all of them. Isn't that right? But he yes. didn't finish. He didn't finish. I mean, he didn't <laughs> that. Then I think they tag teamed their booze before. They booed him, and then he just goes. <laughs> <laughs> he yeah, off. to be fair, he gave the appropriate Australian response. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, it was so funny. Also, we, uh, it was that good was, to see that him, was sort of the Mario Kart thing, where we were doing a trade-off for a Grand Prix of, like, one person would race, but the other person had to finish a drink, like, had to chug it. That's or, even lower. Or, or, or you had to chug it, but it was just you had to... Not one person couldn't be driving while the other person was driving. It was the it was the game attack thing. The game attack that, that thing. Craig and Sean. Yeah. So invented. Or what we realized showed us. Uh, at the third show is that it is ten times easier, at least, to do that out of a cup rather than a can. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You yeah. pour it into a cup first. You can just. And it's gone. Although I shotgun the beer. That's a great shotgun. Up, right? I, I think it's easier as yeah. well because it. You're drinking from the bottom, the, and all the carbonation yeah. goes out. That was the worst fucking part. Is like yeah. we chug the. The beers and then it was just it's like foamy. in there, just like, uh, like uh, I do. I do love Landon though, and it was nice to get to hang out with him briefly. I'm on the fence. He's such a, <laughs> he's such a important, famous man. It's hard to get his time. Wow, well, yeah. it's like trying to schedule time with Gavin Free. 
Mm. I would say that is the fastest I've ever consumed. Because I, I felt bad for Jeremy because he... He's always working his ass off at the community events and drinking his ass off. Fucking hell, I did a lot Jeremy. Of and originally, I was gonna drive. Didn't and he want was, to do. He was gonna <laughs> drink all four beers. Uh, after the second one, he it, he looked like it was getting a little rough. So I volunteered to drink two of them. And Ryan did. Oh, I sucked down two. That's the most I've ever, the fastest I've ever had. Did you two feel beers. anything from? That's what I was gonna say. Is that's the first time I've ever felt anything, really? which was really? just a little dizzy. Yeah, that'll yeah. happen when you like stuff. Just gets like called, a little bit loose yeah. and fuzzy. That's called yeah. euphoria. I didn't get looser feeling. Yeah, I didn't. That was the, what I thought was weird. Is I didn't feel like I was thinking any differently. I just ah, felt a little dizzy. Ah, he was getting dizzy. drunk. That's, that's how you. you get that's oh, how you know. You're how you know? Yeah. Okay. And you're like, oh, I'm just a sober. I'm, I can do anything. I can do yeah. sober. And it's I can do. I can punch a hole through the moon right now. Gross. I can fucking drive. It was disgusting. Chugging any beer is gross. Gross. And yeah, Agreed. I mean, beer's not great. Yeah, it's not yeah. my favorite. There I don't know, some, that, I don't know if that's tipsy or just dizzy. I used to get drunk and want to go running. That was always my thing. I like had a sudden burst of energy. I'm like, I can run for forever <laughs> right I'm now. I'm the opposite. I drink and just want to be on the floor. <laughs> I, I used to like running when drunk because you feel really fast. Yeah, like, I used to oh. run. <laughs> I used yeah. to run home from the pub. Like you and I felt like I was going fast. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you see guys <laughs> just flopping down the street. It's like, what is he doing? Oh, he's running a million miles an hour. <laughs> do y'all do y'all remember like recently when we did that uh, that Get good saga. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Did Trevor tell you guys how well that did? Did really well. Yeah. On the site. On the yeah, site. Did well. Yeah. Crazy well on the site. Yeah. Yeah. Well, so I mean, thank you, people that are watching this. You guys watched the Get Good Saga on the site, and what? it did like tri like super. They were like they, they came because... back and they're like, you guys need to do this more often. Oh, okay. So the comments were good. Yeah. Was, the comments were. Well, I assume well, the comments were don't want to watch three hours, so they kept coming back. To That's what I asked you. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Non-unique viewers. <laughs> Yeah, here's, yeah. A, here's our trick to making you watch the video more. We just make it so you can't watch it in one sitting. We we should have <laughs> yeah. shifted the last two games, like flipped them. We yeah, should have, but, but we could have. We yeah. I mean, we. The yeah. It was the first time trying anything like that, and it was a success. So we'll probably do something like that in the future. More sagas, maybe. Maybe Wait, like, so, uh, they just take a long time to film, obviously, because they're very long. Lasso so. finished as well. That's done. Oh, that's lasso right. is yeah. done, mm -hmm. and people have voted right? that they want Reach as the Reach. next Lasso, Leech which I don't think is an achievement. Reach. We'll do it anyway. Is it really not? Is it in MCC? So no, the game's Reach. not. It's, I think I like, played 360. I think like, I've done Reach on Lasso. Lasso yeah. I think I did it with Andrew and Caleb. There used to be weekly challenges. Oh, where done, you did the Caleb. whole thing. I think I did a lot of it. I don't even know. if we I mean, could do honestly, it on a lot of yeah. it. I, rem I remember a lot of it was being carried through Reach by Andrew. Do we have enough 360? Well, no. Well, yeah. Yeah. Like, do you, re do you remember? Do you remember the episode in Reach when you're you're on the you're on the it's ship and you is. have to like you drop in through the force field? Is that where George sacrifices? Himself? Yeah, where he sacrifices yeah. himself at the end of the level. Spoiler. I remember Caleb, Caleb, Andrew, and and one maybe one of you guys or maybe I mean it was definitely four of us did that. And on Lasso, and it was me and Ca Caleb's fucking great at Halo. As yeah, much as I don't want to give credit ca any credit at all to Caleb for anything, uh, Caleb is unbelievably good at Halo. He was a Halo Two pro player. He's really fantastic. He's better than all of us with his eyes closed. But uh, <clears throat> it was me and Caleb just watching Andrew for forty five minutes at the end, just wa do superhuman <laughs> stuff. That level is so hard at the end. When you fight. You have to go into that control room and you have to fight your way back. I feel yeah, like I we was, couldn't get I past like the hallways. You I might have been like in it. there because we I could, remember. We couldn't get past the hallways, but Andrew was like, "Oh no, here's another elite." <laughs> yeah, I think I remember like the doors closing and him going in, and we could just see him like disappearing into all these elites, <laughs> and we could just hear it, and we could see it. <laughs> it was yeah, you were there, so it was yeah. me, you, Caleb, and Andrew, and it was and that it was that whole like, time where it was like oh, it was like Ray. We'd be like, "Oh, I'm about to die. Oh no, I'm about to no, never mind. I killed everybody. Yeah. Oh my oh, god, there's four the more. Hold on." And we just hear like a, a kerfuffle. Yeah. And be like, All right, next round. And then he'd, he'd, be like, <laughs> he'd be like, oh no, it's uh, 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 invisible elites. Hold on. No, I they're think, all dead. Yeah. I want to say. Oh that no, was, here's six hunters. Hold I on. Think that was all just dead. legendary. No, it was Lasso. I oh no. It was Lasso. Because Lasso wouldn't have had HUD. It wouldn't have had. I think it was Lasso. Do we have like tape on the screen? How are we? I don't remember. I don't think it was Lasso. Maybe it wasn't. Uh, it was apparently, just hard, legendary. Well, apparently, we've done it on. I've done it on legendary. That's not hard. They're all backwards compatible, so we can play it on Xbox One, which is good because we literally ran into a situation today where we wanted to film With a 360 game on just one 360. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. And we and were just trying to find one 360 and four controllers, and we couldn't guess do it. Since the end of Cloudberry, we don't use one. Yeah, yeah don't. We lost Cloudberry them. Cloudberry is, is the death of mine. What was that the... for? That was for 3D Ultra Mini Golf. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Got... Is it not backwards compatible? <clears throat> I don't know. I maybe can try and see. Oh my god, well, that would have taken eight seconds. Why not? <laughs> First of all, I that would have, then we could have probably filmed it today. Also has custom no. stuff on it. Yeah, I had to get over. the maps off of it because I made like yeah. twelve. Uploaded to the cloud. 
well, I had to still find them. I didn't know where they mm, were. It had been years mm, since we even touched mm, them. Mm, I made them like mm. four years ago. <clears throat> and uh, you guys played three. It took you an hour and a half. And we're back. And you didn't want to do it anymore. <laughs> someone, so we're back. <laughs> someone in the chat asked, did my achievement for Lasso ever pop? Because it didn't in the video. And it did a it, week later. 3D wow. Ultra Mini Golf Adventures platform Xbox One via backwards compatibility. Oh, so it totally <laughs> fucking works. <laughs> We uh, still had to find the maps, so that's fair. It, it, you know, uh, it had to be space. <laughs> we so, have to find the maps. Oh, that's that took me all of ten seconds. I did Someone it, else though. asked if we fixed if Criminal Masterminds was fixed. No, no, nah. no. I what think is, it's just you so, get these heists instead of Masterminds. Can y'all answer? Like probably definitively what's gonna happen because I see a lot of confusion and I'm confused. Are you? I know that you guys have filmed two complete videos. And, and one now you're on one, one almost complete. One complete, one almost complete, and then your progress has been completely eroded by the glitch. Correct. Are yeah. you going to play in your personal time to get back up to that point and then continue the video series, or are you just give We it don't up? know if playing up to that point in our personal time, because we've done that twice now. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. Played up to that point in our personal time, and it still resets. So we just don't Even know Even like starting there over? Is, yes, yeah, there's, we started over entirely. There's one person that claims, we started over twice. Yeah. Uh, there's one person that claims that there's a methodology where you just have to be extremely diligent, okay? This round is over, everyone get back in the same lobby. Make sure you're in the same crew. Again, get into the base together. It's pretty and much like every it. time you finish something, run down the checklist of exactly. perfect conditions. And we could try and do it that way, but I mean, it's still it's still as broken as it was. Yeah. Apparently, the issue came from when it, when the Doomsday Heist came out, the Criminal Mastermind wasn't tracking deaths, so people could just get that challenge with, and die, and it was like it was busted. And when they fixed it to make the deaths reset progress, they broke it somehow. And it's been broken, mm. and they have made no effort to fix it since then. Yeah, which um, is I mean, really it's it's frustrating. I mean, it sucks. They should fix it, but it's also probably one of those things that affects. Such a dramatically small yeah. number oh, yeah. of players. I, I would agree. Maybe it, just you guys. it is a part of an achievement, which it is a part of the achievement. Should fix it. They should fix it. Sure. It's also like the, the thing that we're really scared about is <clears throat> if we play back up to that point and it works. I mean, we were getting reset at five out of 20, 29. 29. If we get reset at twenty out of twenty nine, like. Fuck. You know, like, mm. It's just that sucks. Like, yeah. We're just so yeah. nervous about that. But. So, uh, the answer is there's no answer. The answer you know, is, we don't know if you're going to continue it or what not. What we, we kind of decided at the end was uh, we've already just played this three times all the way through the first heist. Maybe we'll try this new methodology, but fuck it, let's wait a few months and okay. just not be sick of it at Which, the moment. Yeah. So, if Which you're looking for putting Because we actually had the bum again. cheese playing yeah. through the most recent time because mm -hmm. we were getting like. In an off camera. In an off camera thing, Michael got shot and killed. Had the bum chain. If uh, so, if you're waiting for Criminal Masterminds, you're gonna be waiting for a while, yeah. maybe forever, but certainly we not. We got in the better next stuff months. coming. We do have other stuff. We have coming. a lot of stuff. Those RC cars are awesome. God. The heist is. Uh, do you think we could do a the Criminal Masterminds of, of our of own heists? No, there's no way. We'd have all we yeah. we have heist. never we've like, never done a flawless heist. I we've mean, never seriously tried to like focus on living at the cost of everything else. That's true. We always are like, let's make it awesome and have I fun. Feel like and we're always like, trying to live because we have we are, but jobs, well, yeah. like not that's, like that's Criminal not, Masterminds. That, that is not a bad idea. Like going back and redoing our original heist, but doing it Criminal Mastermind but style. Then, but then if you die, then when you do, you just go like, ah, oh, we if we die, we, we failed. So like then like then maybe we moonball the person who got killed or something. Like, you, there's got to be some kind of punishment for the person who fucks up, but... I think the comments are the punishment. <laughs> That's true. Some people definitely have much harder jobs than others. I'm going to land a fucking plane yeah, on a road. You, you yeah, mine is... That, your, your heist is my favorite of all time. Oh, really? You, you landed the plane? That's the only one oh. where the... You sort of got away, right? Well, it I was. Mean, I guess technically we're three Ryan of us got away in the first. Three one. of us got away, and then Ryan jumped, I jumped out. I hit the wrong button and fell out. <laughs> <laughs> and I don't think I opened the parachute in time, right? I died. Yeah, you I got, just you remember just... seeing. I, I was like trying to look for you where you were landing, and as I was turning around, you just fly across my vision down the street. I was like, whoa! <laughs> yeah, because so that, that, the plane well, I landed was not made for a land. It, it takes forever. Like five minutes, we don't know. Okay. Our our original heists were so old that they weren't even filmed in HD. Oh, I mean, like, oh, wow. on Xbox One. Yeah. They were, they were yeah, on the they 360 version. Speaking so of like heists, 20, 30, mm -hmm. we, uh, we actually did a heist today. Well, we did. We did a Let's Roll. Yeah, we did. Oh, heist. Oh, yeah. Yeah, 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 that's right. We, right. we played our card game again. We did the Mansion Heist today. You didn't already do that? Uh, not that one. Out not yeah, we, we, yeah, there's I a few we've different. Done an official ones. Let's roll. I don't know that we've done it. We did a bunch of videos like when it was coming out, but we did an actual because there's a there's a price drop on it. I think it's down like. 
15 percent yeah it's gonna be cheaper Taste. i don't know if that's happened yet or if it's gonna happen when with Taste. the release of that the mansion let's roll, abduction but... was very fun it was mm-hmm. super fun like, not having to worry before. about money made it a lot oh yeah that was that was really cool yeah that that, that particular heist because the heist card game comes with four different heists three of them are focus a lot on how much money you collect by the end of it uh but then the mansion abduction one is like you have a specific objective and it's all dependent on how fast you do it sarah lynn underscore you forgot which heist it was it was gavin's heist where gavin blew up the gas station <laughs> <laughs> it was, that was like heist. three oh, seconds yeah. in too. That was one of the first yeah. ones into a pump didn't he <laughs> <Yep>. <laughs> like i heist and dead <laughs> like, and yeah. i know for a fact after that there must have been a conversation of do we record this again Right. Probably. That, yeah, was that my heist that drove into the pump? Yes. Yeah. Because I thought we. You, I know that was you were dead in your my, heist. My, my, my one involved the gas station, but I'm not sure that was. Yeah, right. my, I took Ray my, with me. Mine was the one that, that took. Mm-hmm. It, we we heisted five different convenience stores, and Jeff oh, got Jeff killed. <laughs> in the in the convenience, he got oh, shot in the back and died. The clerk, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it, what was the one? It was probably one of my all time favorite moments in GTA, where I tried to jump off the train. And hit the bridge. <laughs> yeah. that was I think that was that was get Jeff out of jail, right? That yeah. might have been the get me out of jail because we were we were on the train. Oh, yeah. Because you do the animation yeah. for like I've the just got this guy, so I just went. <laughs> <laughs> and I just All I up. know is, without giving any, anything away, I brought the ruckus. Oh yeah, Jeff Je- brought the ruckus. Jeff did, brought right. the ruckus. In oh, here's, we even got a clip oh, here. Oh, this, this is Gavin's heist. Uh, yeah, so this is the yeah, one. this is right oh, where Gavin. Yeah, there's yeah. the fire truck. There's me chucking C4 to blow up the uh, blow up the thing. I think Gavin might be dead at this point already. Like he, l- there you there go. There you go. Uh, it's all coming back to me now. Yeah. My life. It's all coming back to me. <laughs> Kevin, no, I think, was that Ray in the other truck or was that Jeff? I think like, it was Jeff. Jeff. I, think I think Ray was in about. the passenger seat of my <laughs> I remember Ray looking at me. He was he was just like. At the moment it happened, he was like, yeah. <laughs> and afterwards, he was straight at me. He's like, that's it, I quit. Oh. <laughs> oh, all right, Jeff, man. we gotta go film all something. Right. Jimmy right, and I gotta go film a new show. Hey, Ryan. Uh, well, let me, let me tell yeah, you what about... Why don't you tell me about something? Hey, what are you, what are you doing in July, Ryan? Uh, you know what I'm gonna Fucking... do? Fucking... Go ahead. All right. <laughs> I'm hey, gonna go to hey, Ryan, RTX... what are you gonna do in July? I'm gonna go to RTX Austin. Yeah. It'll be here sooner than you think. That's July true. will be. Will you be there? Well, I don't know why there's a question I'll again. Be there. That's a weird call to action. Will will you will you please come to RTX? Isn't that the point of the ad? Camera over there. Hi. Will you please? Uh, weekend passes are available right now at RTX.com, and we can't wait to see all of your faces. The July. F- okay, we can't wait to see all your faces July 5th through the 7th at the Austin Convention Center for the greatest animation, gaming, and comedy event in the world. Damn. In the world. Yeah. We got. Look at the pair on us. Obviously. <laughs> Uh, discuss what you love about RTX. There's a lot of asterisks around it, so I oh, think yeah. they really want us to so get So we gotta it. bullshit this. Uh, I love <laughs> that, uh, RTX, uh, is delivered right to my hometown of Austin, Texas. And I enjoy the, um, the way it keeps time. And the really awesome, well. uh, food they have at the convention center. Oh, yeah, the, the, the um, food. delicious food. Uh, actually, the Southside Flying Pies comes Which in. Which one is that? Really, it's this fucking, it's this one, isn't it? It's always been there. No, it has not. It's always been there. It's always, no, been, it's always been the second to the right. For a while. Okay, I will say this year we are we uh, we specifically achieving her oh, are working. You made me do. You dig. made a real you mess. You did that. Don't, yeah, th- don't this blame is. Others. It's gonna be A H T X this year. A H X this year. We're going hard. We're going hard in the we're paint. We're looking this year. at it, and we're trying to get back to some on, special on stage events. Just achieving her, just for you guys. Uh, yeah. we, we got some other fun stuff planned. Figuring got, that out, but yeah, yeah. Uh, we're gonna hopefully make this a really awesome RTX for you guys. I, I will say on Twitter they kind of put up a tentative schedule, which is pretty much taking last year's schedule and redropping it in. Stuff is still being changed around, but we still have a lot of really really cool stuff planned. Uh, yeah, well, I, mean, I think we're gonna be making announcements for that within the next month or so. So it's really really cool. It's gonna be a fucking awesome year at RTX this year. Yeah. So head over to RTXAustin.com right now and pick up weekend passes for you and your friends. Come hang out with us, greatest community on the planet, July 5th through the 7th at RTX Austin. We'll have panels for all your favorite shows, a live version of Off Topic, the RTX Animation Festival, special guests, big surprises, amazing cosplay, world premieres, so much more. I just muted it. I'm you so excited. It, yeah, I don't even know how I volume. did that. <laughs> I don't know. That's RTXAustin.com. Do not miss it. There we go. There's periods between the you know, right it'll be hot. So it will, will be, be hot. hot. Chad does a, it will be like living on the sun. Chad does a thing during RTX. He does the uh, the RTX rave. 
I've never been to that before, but I used to go to raves back in the, the late 90s and shit. I, I'm, gonna, I'm gonna talk to him about like seeing if I could do a set during You wanna be a DJ? Event. Hell yeah, dude. I, was, I think I could rock a crowd for about an hour do or so. Do you have to drop? Vinyl? Drop Q. And I, I can do a vinyl. I can do a vinyl set if I want. What's dropping? But if it, but if, we're, if it's a rave, it's X, if it's a rave, I'm bringing like old school rave shit, like Crystal Method, Fatboy Slim, Orbital, yeah. Uber Zone. Like I'm going, I'm going old school, like Uber 90s. Uber Zone. Uber Zone, man. Uber Zone. That sounds like zone. a Nickelodeon show. Uber Zone. I think it was a British that's, that's, duo. That's where all the cars they congregate the before you call them the Uber Zone. Oh, the Uber yeah, Zone. Yeah, yeah, that's at the airport. Gotcha. Okay. <laughs> so anyway, but yeah, I'm gonna talk to him, see if I could maybe do like a little bit there. So. Could you it's, get like a light up version of your head to wear over oh, your? Oh yeah, yeah <laughs> like some sort of like head. Jack Mouse oh, yeah. or something. Yeah, that'd be cool. Jack Mouse no longer no longer appearing on Twitch. Or yeah. your like or your junk thing. Was it called? Chunk? Oh yeah, junk. but you get a junk. junk. Yeah. If, yeah, if get someone, junk if, I wonder if Marcus or someone in art could make like a junk head with lights <laughs> on it and shit. I would I would one hundred percent wear that and fucking do a, do a rave. I guarantee he could. The question yeah. is, will he? Uh, I don't know. If, I don't know. Chad, do we have budget? Where's Chad? He's he's nearby Chad's, now. Uh, oh right. He, no, they're in the different building. Building. Remember well, the other over yeah. there now. They're in the best office ever. Didn't you see the short? Oh, yeah, that's right. Another short hit today, I think. Yeah, they're on short number two. I haven't watched number two. Yeah, two. Yeah, two. yeah, yeah. But um, yes, right. two is the number of counting. Well, oh. I was trying to think. I mean, they did. They, there was the the uh, live thing, right? The spirit of Christmas thing. That was kind of like a mm -hmm. soft mm -hmm. one. Mm -hmm. But the, I think the official short just hit last short week. Short shorts. So, and then they have all the uh, the the fucking uh, the RT lives now. Like the one where they put their head against the wall and tried to lift a chair. I don't want to try it. I feel like I could what? do that very easily. It seems like it would be an easy thing to do. I feel like do. I could do that very easily. I feel easily. like Ellie made everyone look like a moron because she could do it just fine. Someone said that it has to do with center of mass and like on women's center of mass. What are the rules again? So you, you uh, so like here, uh, Matt, you want to try it? I don't. Okay, sure. perfect. Okay, this so we have here. a wall that would be This is great for audio listeners. It. Okay, so here's what we're going to do. <laughs> okay, so Matt, okay. you're going to take this. Well, the. Uh, you're going to put your head, stand here, put your feet right here. And then put your head on this, pick that up, and then stand up straight. That's way further down than I had to be. It doesn't matter. It's a, it's a matter about, yeah, just like lean. All right, First so, of all, let me make sure I can pick it up without, okay. I can all right, so Jack has got him leaning down to put his head on the table, well, which is way up, further down that, than that, they put, had to put lean. Your, put your feet over here. Yeah. Probably, he could just, yeah. No, he can't have it on the table because he can use that as a leverage to pull it up. Well, I don't know. Like, against we, can't lean oh, against the, we can't lean against these things. I see, I see, okay. So I have to like... Lean my body over? Here? No, 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 forward, no, no. Matt. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Like this? Yes. yes. There you oh, go. Okay. But put the weight of your head, like put the top of your head on the right, end yeah, of the table. Against it, not on it. No, like, against the edge. Like the, oh, the against edge? the edge. Yeah. Like imagine it's. A I wall. realize it's an awkward now, stance. Keep, now keep your knees straight. Okay. Now pick the pick the thing up. Now pick it up. Lift it. Now now stand up straight. Oh, you shit. Now, see, that step a little bit. Because there's no wall. You yeah. Your head against <laughs> the wall. I don't know. Well, let's we'll try okay. it. Okay. Well, maybe maybe in the post show we'll we do can't it. Make this work work or Bring us a wall in the post show. And we'll do it. <laughs> Great for audio listeners. Audio listeners. I, don't, I feel like it's not that hard, right? It seems like it's not. Maybe but that's the maybe that's the conceit of that thing. Maybe that all the meth they're doing over there is really it's fucking a lot up. of meth. It is a lot of meth. So the lab blown up twice already. I know I missed a word in there, but the lab <laughs> blown up twice already. Let's parse the that. Meth yeah, lab? Gavin. So the lab Both, blown up well, twice no, the already. The meth lab and the lab. When gotcha, lab? Gotcha. When lab hot? Uh -huh. When lab <laughs> lab blown up? Blown up lab. <laughs> this is correct. Hot. How fire the, work? Are you talking about the meth lab or the department of Rooster that was called the lab? Both blown. Up. Okay. Okay. It's there all, we go. It's all <laughs> <laughs> I, I feel like we were in the episode of The Office where Kevin only used like three words to say what he needed to do. That is a <laughs> car no go. <laughs> I'll go grab a wall for you guys. Thank it's you. It's funny listening to what's that actor's name? Brian something. H him doing Kevin in the pilot compared to oh. right at the end. Yeah. Very different. Oh, They're yeah. very yeah. different. He actually well, sounds like a normal human. <laughs> well, if you if you watch like uh, um, Kelly, uh, fucking. Uh, uh, Mindy, Mindy Kaling. Yeah. Mm. Uh, if you like watch Mindy Kaling in the pilot versus like the end, it's so radically different. I mean, yeah. it's just like I mean, I, with, with any character that runs that long, you start leaning into the things yeah. that people really attach to. I think Stanley was pretty much the same the whole show, though. <laughs> He's just quiet he with his crossword. <laughs> Did I stutter? Yes, um, indeed. Ryan from Georgia. Ryan, no talk good. <laughs> 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 Cave Bob Sponge Man. <laughs> oh, man. Yeah, uh, I do. I, I'm genuinely excited about RTX this year. We have a lot of cool stuff. This is a fucking busy year. Yeah, I might is. be going to Washington D.C. in like two weeks, like a week and a half. For the something. fact that it's two weeks away and you're saying I might be. Yeah, yeah, yeah that's, that's what our lives. Well, it was like are. last week. I got maybe 2020. To to not for Hunter. You got to New York. For those yeah. that are curious, I'm, I don't I'm know not if going, I can I'm going to D.C. for personal stuff. I think in 2020 we should have the year of nothing. 
where we don't do anything. <laughs> We, we just let all nowhere. of anyone ask. We just say no. We, we don't go even know <laughs> just, We just we play just... video games and don't even record it. No. <laughs> <laughs> we'll, we'll just spend the second half of 2019 building up a queue that will sustain us <laughs> I for all of 2020. I think it was while we're on tour. I, said, I was saying something like, oh, you know, it's fun playing video games. I, I, I think I said, if, if we all lose our jobs, we should all just keep playing video games, but just not record it. <laughs> and then I think it was someone, Jeff or someone was like, that's called being friends. It's called like <laughs> friendship. I was like, oh, yeah. Well, that was the life I remember. of a normal human. Yeah. What did you my mic? Okay. <laughs> you want that one? It's got mics. No, I was just curious. I was like, is, did they I don't know if I, I never took it off. I don't know if. Yeah, I mean, I still have to like don't, don't feel bad. Can I take the mic off? I think it's under there somewhere. No? All right, I'll leave it. No? Uh, okay. You, you sound put it back on. I didn't take it off. What? J just Gavin? Oh, okay. We can take him off though. What? There. Cool. There. Is he in the dead zone? I've got a mic on now. Mine also. I've got number. Th I've got number three on. Huh? Mine's been no, out that's, for that's a while. That's just a sticker. You got free on? I uh, no. I've got number three that's on. Not legal anymore. I've been lobbed up now. Are you serious? Matt throw a moonball. Matt lives in in fear of moonballs coming <laughs> oh, in. Oh god. I moonball the dust pretty good today. You did. See, the thing is, good, good just catching when, Lindsay's, when Lindsay's here, I don't feel like I can return fire because not accurate Correct. enough. Correct. Your, your throws are the worst. Yeah. Absolutely terrible. It's like a sawn off shotgun <laughs> with just tons of bird shots. Sometimes you kill someone with anywhere. Those. Gavin, Maybe. Gavin, the, the, the mixer got moonballed and it cranked your volume up super <laughs> fucking loud. Oh, really? We did a let's play. And it was like, oh, fuck, Gavin. And it was like, I had well, to. Well, there was one where, I, was it the last. Yeah, it was the heist where my volume was non-existent. Oh, was that? No, yeah. that was it. It was the reverse. Yeah. It was the reverse. It wasn't too loud. It was too yeah. quiet. Yeah, I lied. <laughs> we, do, we do that. The Lindsay Shield we works, but it down. is almost past yeah. being yeah, functional. Yeah, yeah. The Lindsay, Lindsay Shield is coming down. It's like the Berlin Wall. <laughs> <laughs> it's, gonna, it's, it's gonna be fucking just rain of moon balls everywhere. <laughs> They're gonna come back after they, you know. Well, here's the problem: is fucking Gavin and Jeremy have been practicing. They're really dialing in their throws. Yeah, like, I've been I've been keyed into Matt's desk pretty good. Yeah. Like, I've got a good shot on it. Jeremy and I just hit each other as practice. Yeah, See, I, I can't hit switch. you from my desk. You I can, can. You can with the you right can. placement. Yeah. No, over the couch. You can. If you aim from your desk over the couch, you but can probably stuff, hit Gavin. There's stuff up on that wall that I don't want to hit. Like what? Don't want to hit. There's like everything some, is eligible. There's a bunch of stuff that just falls off. Because trust me, when you guys were gone for that week to Australia, I was practicing. <laughs> and believe me, I got Michael and Jeremy pretty nailed down. You are a little bit harder, but mm. I have to aim it at Michael. Like I have to throw harder and at Michael, and then right. I'll hit you. So they're the Can't same hit you without risking Lindsay's just death. Yeah, yeah. I got, <laughs> I got a Lindsay shield. I got a nice Lindsay bubble around me. Jeff and Trevor, I run a risk of hitting myself. So <laughs> it's true. It's true. But you, I can't nail down because that flag up uh, above the wood that makes a whole thing where it's like it could go anywhere. Oh, I bet. Well, no, use the other that. wall. I, I'd have to walk out and do. I'm, I'm talking about from a sitting position. He's, you, a, he's a lazy moon ball. I bet. I Dude, bet I can. Ninety percent of our desk. moon balls are from standing. I'm sure you could, but you're more of a veteran than me. I don't, I'll, I don't I'll have find the spot for you and just keep hitting that spot. Jeremy almost dislocated Michael's jaw. With <laughs> Were you in the room for that? Yeah. It was violent. Yeah, it yeah. just hit the side of his face, completely unprotected. It hit him like here, and he and he just went. <laughs> he, had, he had to do the thing where he's like calms himself down. So every time Michael gets hit in the face of the moonball, it's like time briefly stops. <laughs> it just hit him. It rattled his face. The sound was phenomenal, and then he was just like. <laughs> And everyone else in the room was like, <laughs> "Yeah, it's pretty pretty rough. That's pretty rough. You don't want." That's to be the hit. spot right there where you can knock someone out too. Yeah. yeah. Can you imagine him get, taking one to the face and just dropping? <laughs> that would be incredible. That would be cool. That yeah. would make it such a good video. <laughs> move, 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 knockout. <laughs> All right. Well, we should probably wrap this. Yeah, up. we got. We, we actually too much stuff to have to go film yeah, other no. stuff. If we're gonna try to knock out an anthem thing today, we got like a hey, post so, uh, show. Go. Uh, yeah, we gotta do the post show too. Go uh, before we let you go though. Uh, there's still tickets available for uh, the live events. Uh, oh yeah. Get your yeah. tickets for uh, Always Open and the RT Podcast. Just go to universe.com slash right live ATX19 and yeah. buy your tickets. Unfortunately, I think Off Topic is sold out. Um, we're not supposed to say that. Off topic is there's tons of tickets available. <laughs> it's Buy all the tickets. Man, it's it's so, so there's so many. many seats. No one bought one yet. We nope. probably weren't <laughs> supposed to call it out that we weren't supposed to say it either. But oh, okay, that's cool. Total, <laughs> so many seats. Please, and we're, we're, it's going to look really embarrassing when we go and there's no one Empty sitting there. Empty chairs. So please, sparsity. Pick them up. Didn't know I was not supposed to say that. Film just, more just, Detroit. Just cut us off humor. before it gets there. worse. It's okay. Bye. 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 Right. Bye everyone. Love you. Bye. 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 Thank you.
Thank you.